try me. Yeah. Is this? Sour Meats Twins And hey, yo, the twins is here uh -huh. With valid topics and some solid discussions Shining light on talent, the bullshit we're confronting Sharing the news, comparing point of views and opinions Staying in tune with the current state of the culture we live in From sports to fashion, it's all about the craft for the passion Life, music, current events, and main attractions So shape up and get shipped out, we're here to forewarn you I better get right or get left, restore order What up, boy? I'm outside. All right, I'm coming to get you right now. We live, we live. We live? Yo, yo. I don't hear nothing. What's going on, I don't folks? see nothing up here either. Hello, hello. Yo, what's good? What's good? People, if you hear me. Can you see us? I don't see it up here. Technical difficulty, if y'all see us right now, we dealing with a little issue right now. Hold on, I keep talking, I'm trying to rock outside. Yeah, we got a good old guest coming in and all that and all that. What's going on, y'all? Speakers are on. Okay. We having some in-house slight technical difficulties, unfortunately, but we still here. You know, rain, sleet, or snow, regardless, we here. You know what I mean? What's going on out there? How y'all feeling, man? How y'all feeling out there, man? I do you suck, yo, by yourself, yo. Nah, this, we, cause I don't know what's going on. We, we, you know, my weekend was alright. It was cool. It was quiet. You know what I mean? Calm. It was calm. Yeah. You know what I mean? Nah, it was calm. Swave just um went to get the guests real quick, yo. So you know what I'm saying. What's just good, nigga? What's up, bro? How you doing? Yeah, but um, so yeah, yo, how was your weekend though, yo? What's up, man? Talk to me, man. It was quiet, it's a you know. Weekend. It was calm. Just chilled out. Got a little bit of rest, a little bit. You, you know what I mean? Royalty? Not as much as I wanted, but seen a little bit of the royalty shit, a little bit of that shit. I didn't see as much as I wanted, but I seen a little bit. Think, yo, I I my fault, my fault, my fault, my fault. I had to go get my brother real quick. I think I seen enough though for what I did see, but watch some of that shit. Some of it was fire, some of it wasn't. From what I saw. Mm -hmm. There we go. See, I feel much more comfortable, much more better now. Okay, homie, niggas in the tune, niggas in the tune, niggas in the tune. We got it up, we got it up. Pause. Okay. We see and hear you. Okay, okay, there. All right, how y'all doing? How y'all doing? How y'all motherfucking mothers doing? How y'all people's doing? This fucking 2020 is Restore Order Podcast. Sway 7 in the building. IP in the building. Heavy you know bags in the building. We out here, you hear me? I'll hear the effect of applause, technical difficulty. Fuck it. We always we need the like the effect right now. So Alright, so this for this episode of yo, what episode are we on? 12. Like 12? Oh, right. Woo! Yeah, yeah, we, we 13. 12. 13. Damn, good shit, yo. Good like shit. 12. Consistent. I like that consistency. That's the that's that's the key. A lot of black people don't be consistent, B. Mm -hmm. We gotta change that. Exactly. But um, for this restore order, I got some real shit I wanna talk about first before I bring my guests up here. I got my brother in the house and all that, but before I bring my guests real quick, I'm gonna let him get comfortable. Sounds good. Let, 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 him, let him get his lungs right and all that, you know what I mean? I wanna talk about some real shit. Yeah, this shit is fucking crazy, bro. And it ain't for the faint of heart, so I keep it real. I'm going to warn y'all niggas, if you're a father, you might get real affected by this. Um, so, yeah. this week, something came down my timeline. Shout out to my boy ARP, right? ARP, what up, champ? ARP put out a blog recently of a friend of his named L Dot. Name is Leon. We call him L Dot. And L Dot had a 20, uh, uh, excuse me, he had a daughter that just recently passed away. She was 10 years old, she died of cancer, right? And um, as a father of a daughter, that shit hurt. So, first and foremost, L. Dot, 
I'm sending my deepest condolences Word, man. to you and Word. your family. Blessings to you that's, and your family, man. For real, though, that that's crazy. My daughter's ten years old, so so um, much, yeah. My even out, I know my even resonates even crazier you. with you. Yeah, my daughter's I'm, seventeen, be eighteen in a couple of weeks, but you know what I mean. Just hearing this, hearing this story and vision. If you caught it. ARP put a blog up, and at the end of the blog, he got some video footage of the father, Lamont, trying to attend his daughter's funeral, and he was barricaded by the police from getting to the casket. From the the other family, the mother of the daughter, her Ain't family, the police. They, they all stood hands like a... Excuse me. They all stood, hold their hands like a... A, 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 a barricade. Yeah, they made a barricade. Like it's some kind of civil rights movement protest, and they sh they they blocked him along with the police from getting to the casket and seeing his daughter. This footage fucked me up. It wounded me. I'm not even gonna hold you because this shit. And hey, hey, real quick though, I, I like I like skim through the blog. Right. And, and for anybody out there who needs to see it, I'm gonna post it actually on on the 50 Minutes of Fame right. channel after the show. I just have Yeah, it's going to be in the description it. blog for anybody that want to see the footage yeah, that um, I'm talking about. What was the backstory, though? Like now, the backstory, I'm not fully... What I'm going to say is this. The dude, L. Dot, he was supposed to... He's supposed to hit... He going to tune in. He told me he was going to tune in and um, Skype. he might Skype in. Okay. So let's let's hope that happens. But it, just in case, though, the backstory I have so far is that L. Dot, you know, he had a rocky relationship with his baby moms. He was getting... um. He was seeing his daughter on supervised visits. Um, his daughter had cancer, which she passed away from, and he had no idea his daughter had cancer. He was never told, never informed. He found out. He found out on media. Facebook from a third party Wicked. who asked him a, something about why is his daughter hair cut off or something like that. Wicked. So yeah, well, I got the clip. Yeah, so, so we could play. I only took like twenty seconds. Because yeah, you I could play a little bit of it just you know to show mean? the people what I'm talking about, man. Yeah, scroll down. You don't see them. You don't see them. Stop playing at them. You don't see them. Close the circle. You don't see them. You don't see them. This is what's going on at my niece's funeral, bro. Please, somebody, somebody, tune in, bro. See what, see what the, see what the NYPD do at my ten-year-old niece's fucking funeral. The other family is blocking the fucking casket, bro. Is this not crazy? They got a barricade between my family and everybody else, bro. This shit is embarrassing, bro. They got like Ready? fuck out of here. The same hairs would have been putting me in fucking cuffs, nigga. <coughs> something they would have been tasing me, shooting me something. Yo, now listen. niggas is wilding. Yo, listen. I'm gonna tell you something. I would have went to jail that day. Dead ass. I would have went to jail that day. Facts plus facts. Ain't no, wild. ain't no force legal. on this earth that's gonna keep me from seeing my child, especially laying in a fucking casket. I don't give a fuck. See, this the thing, and and, and, and I'm kind of, I'm getting passionate about this because you know I, when I first watched it, I watched it along with my wife, and she made a little comment that got me mad because she was like, "So what? But you don't know what he did to her." We don't know. I don't know. And at this point, I really, I'm don't, going off the I really don't give a fuck because right. I'm going what off I do know that is I that see. this little girl is dead right? and he is the father. So as the father, how dare you deny this man the right to look at his child in the cast? And he has a court order. Oh, oh, I ain't even admit. Thank you for saying and that. And he had a fucking now, mind court you, he order, had a, yo. He had a rocky relationship with the buddy to be mother. They were going back and forth to court. He had a court order to be at the funeral signed by a judge. And they still didn't let this man... You understand me? Man, listen. I, it would have been blood, B. It would have been blood. That shit would have turned to 300 in the funeral home. What? Now, I, I commend Nigga. L. Dot for keeping your composure because, you know, I I know I'm here saying I would have went to jail, but the last thing, the, 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 I bet you they wanted you to go to jail. They wanted you to react. They wanted somebody on your family to pop off so they could get arrested, and that would have made their day even more. Yo, the grandmother of the daughter was laughing, yo. Aha, uh -huh, uh, baby, aha, uh -huh, you can't see the baby, aha, uh -huh, that's I uh, Like, bitch, your granddaughter in the casket, you think this shit is funny? This shit ain't funny, my- Pardon you all pardon me. Listen, so, the shit that fucked my head up, right, is, so one of the cops decided that he gonna take matters into his hands, 
Shout you know, out to this cop, by the way. To him. Shout big out to you. To I don't know what him. I don't know your name, homie, but whoever you are. Shout out to you. He man. took L Dot out the room. He took L Dot downstairs in the basement of the motherfucking funeral home and he made everybody believe L Dot left. They put a police jacket on L Dot. They told him to stay here. L Dot was down there for about an hour. They brought him back upstairs when they cleared the funeral home. The lights mm -hmm. was out and everything for him to see his daughter. They had to reopen the casket, take the blanket off the child, and they gave him 20 minutes. That's real. That's real. And you know what? And it's real fucked up. It's fucked up. But That's really fucked up. He got that go much. That. And he got at least that he much. got that. But how he had to get Come it is so on, that fucking was crazy. Like, my, listen, what? Listen, listen what here. Was. Listen here. That was man shit. Facts. That cop is a father. That, mm -hmm. man, that shit resonated man. with the like with him. It's sad as it is. It's sad. It's sad. I agree with it. I be trying to talk about it all the time, but nah, that's a fact. And then I'm gonna keep it real. Just I love my wife. Don't get me wrong. This ain't no beef. Me and my wife is cool, but it started a little heated <laughs> conversation because of what she said after watching it with me. And it just get put me in a mind state that women, women, they petty is on another level, yo. Yeah, that, 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 women that, that, petty that, could be that, on that, some, that, other, and they that, got no that, bound, they got no limit with they petty. Like, y'all would go as far as holding a dead child against her father. And then my wife had the nerve to say, oh, well, you don't know what he did to her. Like, this is my thing. <clears throat> I don't give a fuck what he did. At this point, the child is dead. She was better off letting that man see his child. Whatever bond that holds you, okay, y'all got a bad relationship, cool. Whatever bond y'all hold y'all is the child. The child is no longer here. Let that man see the child and go about his business. You ain't never got to worry about that man. And on top of me having a court order? And he had a court order. And fuck them police, because once he showed that court order, all of them should have parted. Fuck was they still standing there for? That's what I'm saying. Somebody got slapped. They would have took me to jail, and then on top they would all got sued. yeah. I got arrested. Right. I know me. I know I. I know we would have been in there. I definitely got tased or something. Somebody would have did something. Cause to that's me. crazy. You don't. Cause do I would have did something to somebody. You don't. That's do worth that. everything. Like you don't do that. Like that's first, that. first of all. Police don't show up to 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 infant funerals unless it was a violent. Now nah, okay okay so let me break up why the police was called. So. L Dot got there with his family, and it was a member of her family holding the door closed and not letting them in the funeral home, saying that the funeral was not open for them. After a little back and forth, they pushed through the fucking door, like, bitch, if you don't move. And then the police was called, because they shoved through the door to go see the child. So that's why the police was even there. So I guess the violence came from the shoving through let me end this bitch. That's I want to see my baby. Beef. That's forever beef, you, my nigga. You, I can't forgive nobody for no shit. I like couldn't that. even walk away now. Like that's, if, if that's, she did some shit like that to me, nah, I couldn't even just be like, "Hey, I try to dead. We don't fuck with each other. Beef, have you live your life, my life." Now, oh, I'm gonna get this bitch. <laughs> Yo, I can't yeah, even walk forever, away now. Now beef. you made a natural born enemy for life out of me, B. You, your I'm family, sending every goon net. I don't even hit women. You, I'm breaking family, her jaw. I'm doing whoever's it. Whoever's involved, y'all all gonna get it. Yeah. The Fuck mother, your mother getting it for laughing. John Wick, all y'all niggas. Yeah, I don't, I don't, I, that was so fucked up, man. And you know, the court system is really designed for women and children, y'all. And that shit is, that shit is, it, it's so fucking, men don't really get good in the court system. We don't really, for us to really be treated fairly in the court system, the mother of the child has to be fucked up on drugs and out in the streets living fucking every nigga that comes like it gotta be a real fucked up situation B she can't just be unemployed and can't know don't know how to feed the child cause they'll still award her the child the nigga got yo we can yeah. have all our ducks in a row all our money our money could be up job everything yo, they still won't really like, real fuck quick, with us though, in court like, houses before we move on though like what would be like like what would you like like what would be like the ultimate like what would he have to do for her to have that hate in her heart, like you feel me, like I don't care though. This is this, I don't really. It don't care. matter. Like, you gotta put really that care. aside, like. No, you know all right. Mean? Matter of fact, we can't even say that. We we can't. We don't know. Now, we don't. We don't know what he did. What 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 warrant is that what, though? We we don't right. We don't know what could warrant that, my nigga. Like the girl the child was ten is, years old. When my she nigga, passed. the child is dead, son. The child's no longer here. There's no longer a tie that binds. The child is gone, son. So. 
Now, in the video, in the video, somebody mentioned something about right, she mad because I was fucking evil, with somebody cuzzle. else. She mad because he was fucking with somebody else. You hear somebody say that in the video. Yo, the, anybody that want the video is going to be in the description box. I can play it. It's a little long, so I don't want to play it on this show. It take, it's like 18 minutes long and all that. So I can play it whenever. But that shit I'm, evil, yo. It's evil, that bitch my nigga. evil. That shit is evil, yo. But when a child dies, though, and you do that, right, 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 and she could stay with the nigga. My nigga, let the nigga fuck with another bitch, though. Yo, come up here, man, cause you over there talking, my nigga. I might as well introduce you, man. Come join this conversation, brother. My brother rocked this monster in the fucking building, yo. This is our guest for the night. My nigga Rockman Marshall, let me move that, over so he get comfortable. He yeah, y'all yeah, over there talking. Y'all probably ain't hear nothing he was saying, and he making some valid points. So I'm going to just have my brother come yeah, sit in. You come sit in too, brother. He off camera today. Oh, he off camera? Oh, all right, you good. Yeah. Everybody, make some noise for my brother Rockman Marshall. I don't give a fuck if you clap in your living room, if you cooking in your kitchen. Yeah, Put your hands together. This man's a legend. You heard me? <laughs> Word. Both the mother. Shout out, big time. Ah. That's my nigga. <laughs> Yeah, so go ahead and talk to the mic what you were saying. Real quick, right? too, man. Get that rock album, man. Yeah. That's, oh, yeah. Get, come everybody on, get that rock album. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I got a, I got a lot happening. A yeah, lot yeah, happening. Yeah, we we got to that. We're going to talk about it. But go ahead and make that point. I, what, what was I saying? About the, 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 the how spike, females. Oh, yeah, yeah, the spike yeah, yeah. Don't bitches. nothing. First of all, I have a saying, and it goes, never underestimate the petty of human beings. Facts. Like, you just never know. A nigga could be, like, I'm not even, I'm I'm not above or beneath it. Like, it's a dude that 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 used to rob me when I was eight. If I when I if I catch him, mm -hmm. you know, <laughs> like to this day, yeah, to this day, so like to this, was, day. to this day, to this day, to this day, dog, to this day. To this day. You know what I'm saying? You just never know. Like if somebody violent, if you feel wronged, it ain't no expiration date on that shit. When facts plus uh, tax, I hold you, grudges. You know what I'm saying? Until you niggas uh, until sliced you me up years ago, I see them niggas evolved. to this day. I'm running down. Yeah, yeah, you know, yeah. you can become an evolved human being, and maybe you could. But like I'm pretty zen, I'm pretty zen lordian right now, and I, it's still like that nigga who used to take my mom's change from me. Yeah. Nah, I, I catch him. Yeah, but anyway, the point I'm trying to make is nothing. I've I never see. Well, the point that I was making is I never seen nothing piss a woman off like that except another woman. Like I didn't see women stay with dudes. Through drug problems, mm -hmm. gambling problems. Right. Mm -hmm. This nigga done lost the rent for the nineteenth time in the dice game right. and shit. And she might curse him out, but she stay. Let him fuck another bitch. It's World War Three now. Mm -hmm. You understand what I'm saying? Like that's the one right there that be crumbling. And in that the video, cards. in the video, somebody was like, "Yeah, she mad because he was fucking with another bitch and all that." So it definitely, but that's not enough. To me. Yeah, that's, that's not for that. No, it's, no, this, but this nothing is, not for that. Nothing rock. warm no, is that. Not yeah. for that. Rock. Look, I'm saying, when you rock, we would have went to jail. Hmm. Oh yeah, we would have went to jail that day. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah okay. Yeah. I'm saying, yeah. take when me you, now. When you <laughs> the fuck? Well, I'm just saying. Look, y'all niggas is crazy. All right, if y'all think like, y'all go do this in front of me with, with mine. When you, when you fuck another bitch, now. That drug problem, that gambling problem, all of that shit becomes unforgivable now. Mm -hmm. Right. All of it. You right. understand what I'm saying? That's like all, void, all of the other shit. Like, you know, as long as you wasn't giving that cock away, <laughs> she put up with all that shit. Right. The, at the scent of some other bitches or another bitch or whatever. It's over. World War Three. Yeah, World War Three. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. And I mean, I'm I'm just saying. So women are the spiteful creatures. And then and then if they not together, like let's just say when you're not together, when you mm -hmm. break up, and but you still have a seed, right? That's you have a seed. Sex. Now that that's kind of worse now because mm -hmm. I mean it's fucked up as it is. I advocate the opposite. Of, I'm like me and my daughter, mom got a dope relationship. You need like, right. like like you y'all should try it, right? But what you see most of the time is like when they all right. They broke, all right, she caught him cheating or whatever. Now they broke up. Now they forced to deal with each other for on whatever level still. Mm -hmm. That's what make it worse. Because now you're not my girl. I don't have to la-la-la and la-la-la and la-la-la for you. Right. But they still have emotions involved. 
Mm. You understand what I'm saying? He he still feels certain ways about her, and she still feels certain ways about him. Right. And but you, but ain't neither one of you got, a, got actually technically got the right to be speaking on some of the shit you got feelings about, mm-hmm. and the arguments just get more harsh, mm-hmm. more disrespectful, the right. spiteful, more spiteful. Yeah, like everything. all of that shit yep. just start getting terrible. They get people start getting covered more coverage to say shit that they didn't mm-hmm. have coverage to say before. Mm-hmm. Now you saying it at will, like mm-hmm. yeah, you fuck it. Because that's how you. That's what you always meant to say. That mm-hmm. resentment and all that. That I resentment. Mean, that shit mm-hmm. comes out. Yeah, and this shit. But that and nothing warrants that shit though, man. That shit was Yeah, so my condolences out to my man L Dot. Also, he wanted to bring awareness. So if y'all find this video, please share it. Because the little girl name was Mana. Rest in peace, Mana. And um L Dot is really going far with this. He really trying his his name is Leon. He really trying to take it to the to the courts and, and make a law out of this. Mean to say that no father can ever be held. Mm-hmm. It's like the Mana law or something. Like he mm-hmm. really going far and trying to make a statement with this. Like yo, should no father ever have to go through this ever Facts again? Plus I don't give a fuck what you crazy. went through with the mother. If that's your child, you have just as much right to that child as she did. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? And, and the fact especially that she with a court order, with a court, he had came with a court order, yo. Listen, man. This country has been programming us for years Mm -hmm. to to not value the black man. Yeah. I could have said that sentence with mad more words. Right. But I just took a lot of the words out the middles of them shits. You said you kept the the meat and potatoes up. The meat and fucking potatoes. Yeah, no doubt. You know what I mean? Like, you ever been, like, you ever go to the hospital with your shorty or to the, you know, to, like, (coughs) like, I've been to an abortion clinic with a shorty before. Like, you ain't got no rights, B. Like, they don't even want to talk to you. Like, you sit out there, nigga. Like, like you, they, you got a whole baby of you trying to get rid of, and they just making you take a number. Like, get out, like, like, <laughs> like, like wow. Know, it's the the shit is so deep. Like, you know what I mean? Like, as I don't even like to like I don't like to talk to people this deep on the first conversation, like mm-hmm. this, on on the first date. You understand what I'm saying? Like, this shit is that was crazy. I just watched the video. It's Sad. so deep on how like everything. Everything that everything that we was well, so much of what we've been fed, what we what we've been ingesting in ingesting visually, uh, in our fucking in our stomachs, in our ears, right, has been designed to slowly kill us, be facts. Program. Like either kill us or kill our spirit one. Like you understand mm-hmm. what I'm saying? Fact and or brainwash us into killing yeah, each other. The, the, yeah, that, that's mm-hmm. the killer spirit. That's all part of it. Like you right. know what I'm saying? So it's like, like, and I'm mad at the woke community. I'm mad at the woke community because y'all like, like y'all niggas, y'all woke motherfuckers. I mean. <laughs> I'm like, <laughs> <laughs> listen, talking right. shit. Listen, what right. we do? This is restore order, my nigga. Talking real, shit. This is real talk. Like, how you woke, but but you hate black people and you black. Like, how you how you how you a woke black woman woman, but you ain't fucking with black men no more. I mean, don't get it twisted, right? To each his own. Facts, but. Don't talk that shit without talking how black men got so fucked up. I gotta give you, Preach, a, I gotta give you a history list, lesson on my fucking Facebook, bitch. <coughs> Preach. I gotta nigga. do that. Nah, don't talk that shit. Right. You understand what I'm right. saying? Right. And then leave that out. Right. Right. Cause if 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 not, then you if 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 that ain't the case, then you only half woke or you fake woke. Facts plus tax, all that niggas. I'm woke, woke, woke. Nigga, shut up. Right. Wake up, nigga. Tell you motherfuckers something. I had knowledge of self when I was 13. You know what I did after that? Became a D-set. <laughs> Talk, nigga. 
You understand what I'm saying? Like, like I didn't see this shit from every angle. I was like, all right, we gonna do, it, but, 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 but it ain't this. It's this. Mm -hmm. You understand what I'm saying? Like, like, like. That, that's where that's the area niggas was raised in, though. Like yeah. you said, the systematic bullshit. They we was placed in a, in a. We are products of our environment. Like just because, like just because I say that to say. Just because I had knowledge itself, just because I had 120 and all this, don't mean that I was civilized. Right. I became a decept after that. Right. Right. You know what I mean? So in your little books, you done found a couple of books, you can talk about now you now you wanna tell black people all this sucker shit about uh you stop with that victim mentality or get over the past and shit. Mm -hmm. Nigga. It only been, uh, it ain't even been a good hundred years yet. We since. still going through bullshit. Like, 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 the, nigga, like racism the, will never die, man. My yo, you know what? Die. The programming is still, it's still, it's, 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 it's still in it's, play. It's, it's car body. So, yeah, it's still in play. So yeah, so yeah. you know, I, I mean, I know that's what that's why I don't like talking about that shit because I take us way off topic all the time. Yeah, shit, but, we did jump you know off topic a little. But the, the moral of the story is what I what I was getting at is like right. how. Women can be that spiteful towards they men. Nah, that's a fact. Because like, they programmed to hate us. <coughs> yeah. You know, hip hop. We ain't. We you know. We ain't help the. We ain't. We ain't help. We ain't help <laughs> Yeah. Like you help. know what I'm saying? Like you know when we was going back. You know because we feel like we we play for different teams. You understand what I'm saying? So it's like, regardless, we grew up like you know we grew up under hip hop raised so many of us and in hip hop some of our staple songs and shit like gold gold digger epmd you know snoop dog and you know what i'm saying Niggas don't trust no bitch yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> type of all of that shit you understand bitches what i'm saying ain't shit but hold it yeah, yeah but but, yeah. but 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 i i i can say that we didn't help but what i but what i will not leave out is we our mentality was wounded too like this is we were victims of the shit you like like how many like Biggie named Biggie called himself Frank White. Facts. Ain't nobody ain't nobody talking about the negative effect that that movie had on our culture, right? You I just don't want, leave no witnesses. You just want you just want <laughs> you just want to talk about the negative effect that the rappers have on the niggas, community. Niggas right? always was get um, idolizing negative right. shit but, like that. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. You know, like, like, but but what what I'm saying is like so just just in general. We grew up feeling like we was on the other side of our woman. You know, right. we were on different teams. One of the dopest memes I read in the meme generation was somebody said something about, you know, with, with, with you and a couple in an argument, you know, in debate, it's not you against him, it's you and him against the problem. You know what I mean? Right. Like, like that's something like, 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 gotta be compromised. Like, that, that right there is the shit right there. Facts. You know what I mean? Like, Facts. it's you and your whiz against <coughs> the, the problem, problem. not Facts. you against her. You know what I mean? And that, yeah, if, that's if, a problem. Right. You if families I mean? start to look at, 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 you know, when we start to look at shit like that, then, then maybe a bitch won't be denying a nigga his... So spiteful. So spiteful, like yeah. at the wake, you can listen. That shit different. was that's different. This whole place is going like <laughs> yo, everybody. Going and then I know my family, so I know somebody got punched in their mouth. Somebody, yeah, like, somebody would have it would have got bloody in there, and, and, it, and it sounds weird because it sounds sad because you thinking it's at the baby weight, the baby the weight. You thinking like, damn, this is the little girl. The girl is ten years old in the casket, yo. And this is a beef between a mother and father that the mother just don't want to let go. She's just so spiteful that she don't want the father to see his child in a casket. Yeah, that is beyond. crazy to me. That's beyond. beyond. That's beyond spite. Yeah, that's crazy. Yeah, that, I, so though, so it, anybody that catch wind of this video, please share it. Mm -hmm. Um, again, my condolences hey, go out. So, so the original videos on the Rare Breed it's on channel. The Rare Breed channel. Shout the ARP. Shout I'm gonna to put ARP. it on the 15 Minutes of Fame channel tonight, tomorrow, right, or something. So it'll be up. You and, know what um, I mean? Also, before we leave this segment, real quick, um, I got one more thing I want to say. Some real shit. Um, you know, I'm from Harlem, but I live in Brooklyn now. And, and, you know, in Brooklyn, every now and then I run into this lady picking up my son from school, and I run into her daughter. Well, it's sad to say her daughter is missing right now. 14-year-old girl. 14-year-old girl. Um, put up the...
Um, can what is it? Kenya, Alexa, something like. Jenna, Aleta, uh, Jenna, Jenna Alexa, Alexa Hospitalis. She been missing since January 14th. Her mother, the no, sweetest. Since the 9th. I mean, January 9th, excuse me. Her mother's the sweetest lady. And just to see her all broken up like this rattled me. Yeah, so take please this picture, share it, man. Get share it, get this it picture. There, get it out there. Amber alert this shit, man. Word. That's crazy. Let's bring out. Let's bring out our young ladies home. I, I actually looked up, right? And it said that there's 64,000 missing, black, missing women. black women in this country. That's fucking bananas. That's exponential. Yeah, it's, it's all part of the conspiracy, B. Like, they got our women saying, fuck us, they don't need us. But at the same time, we need to, we got to protect them. You understand oh, yeah. what I'm saying? Like, it's like. We got to protect them. No, we got to. We got you to protect the saying? queens, man. But, but y- 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 like. Same shit I said. You organ can't be. Harvesting. Please stop running in the other direction, queens. The please. organ harvesting shit is real That's right all there, I'm man. Saying. Yeah, listen, listen. To the women that online or the young girls listening, you know that, that human trafficking shit is real, too. And they lure people through social media and internet. Mm. And they prey on you young girls. So just be careful, man. Stay grounded. Keep. Keep, keep close knit to somebody that's gonna keep you grounded. Don't Word. don't veer off. It's scary out here. Cause you will not be founded. <laughs> shit is real. I, I shit just, is real. And on some real shit, just just in the in the spirit of keeping it a hundred, and in the spirit of justice and keeping things as fair as I can. Any niggas who be talking about they don't fuck with black chicks no more, y'all suckers too. Like, y'all some suckers. I feel, I really feel like y'all some suckers. Like, fight me. Y'all some suckers. Y'all wanna do that. Y'all some suckers. But shit, man, let's <laughs> let's get these like, positive words out for these people, man. You know what I mean? Man. Blessings <laughs> to my man L. Dop and his family. Facts. You know what I mean? Blessings go out to him. And let's try and bring that little girl home. We're about to shoot to a video, and we'll be right back. Right uh, back. Just Rats or Ron Browns? Yeah, well, we're gonna talk to my man just Rock, Rock. Digital Deja Vu Thinking about my nigga Pierre shit We always keep talking shit on me on my rap shit I used to be like, yo, I got raps for this The help to scale this shit, I got raps for my shit He be like, nigga, just rap, nigga This motherfucker rap, nigga, you think too much, nigga, just rap So, this for my nigga right here I'm gonna show this, this is what I do when I just rap I'ma just rap, let's go, y'all ready? For that do re amigo fall, so don't lie, Tito Santana looking at you. Long clips, banana rama, it's gonna be a crew summer Better have your slammer, a flammer Panhandlers got hammers, imagine the niggas with bandanas It's out of hand for some, but for me it's straight cheesecake You be safe with me and BK, stay for three weeks straight I'm Don Rocco from the Sackman Knock, ho, fuck town It's kung fu, more like gun fu, kung pow Throw caps at your reptiles, kung lao, no in the dawn, sundown from one round. Do what you do, say what you heard, don't say. Don't hate, I keep to the thousand like one third Andre. Last year I took my biggest loss, this year the earth gon' pay. The streets want blood, and we serve in the place, performing transfusions. You and your man's losing. The Cancun, I'm have them do a dance, shoot to the spring break. You can bamboozle, you can wash tears, shampoo, and bamboo, and wrapped up. Clap through the dream shake, I blam Houston's rockets. Bang zoom to the moon or to your tomb. Shun vacate national lampoon. You're a peon. Beyond that, you're a damn fool. Translucent as plans to jam. Who? No, no, no. That's a no, no. Don't go. Save yourself some time. Tag your own toe. Back out your own crow. Blow off your own nose. Go for it. Use the faux faux. Fucking boat. Nigga, kill yourself. You should drink a motherfucking bottle of Lysol with your bitch. You know what you should do? I want you to take a deep breath and hold it. Keep holding it. Keep holding it. About rock now, back boy. Pretty it's much. Time. Live, live. We back. Yo, we, we back, back, we back, we back, we, we back. back. order. Yo, go subscribe to 15 minutes, 15 M O F E radio. 
Please subscribe do that. to Team Homie TV. Please do that. Please do that. Follow my man Ike P the God, Swave Seva, Rockness BCC. Please oh, do yeah. that. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. My, I got a YouTube too, Monster Nation. Monster Nation. Follow Monster Nation. Hit them bells. Hit the subscribe button. Yeah, all man, that. Yeah. You know what I mean? Now. We got my brother sitting here, bro. Well, man, good, good guy, good this guy, good, crazy, good freight family I, member. I came of ours. up, me and I came up huge fans of you and Rugby. Rest in peace, Rugby. Oh, fucking health is skelter. The fucking nocturnal album mm -hmm, was like, I tell him soundtrack time. Yo, Rock, you already know the story. Me and I done got a deal. I'm gonna tell the world now. Fuck okay, that. We got a deal. With <laughs> that. Tell I, tell I, I, what they said to us. I, what they, they say, said. yo. <laughs> We yeah, like, fuck with back in the days of shopping demos and shit, yeah, right? Like back in the days of shopping demos, me Nigga and I, you know, we had the crew, you know what I mean? NBC, newborn chaos, turn the CVs and all that, right? Boom. Nigga said, yo, we want to fuck with y'all, but y'all sound too much like the dude from Brooklyn. What's their name? No. Oh, yeah, the Health the Skelter Kid. <laughs> we was like, what? Yo, son, but no, that wasn't, it was like, we heard that like four times. Well, the mother. Like the <laughs> Niggas say, yo, we sound like the Harlem Elta Skelter. I said, wow. I'm sorry, man. No, 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 no. Not for nothing, no. I'm sorry. We was listening to y'all niggas, bro. So, yo, first of all, nobody sound like Health and Skelter. Let's nah. get that out the no, way. No, right we don't. Now. We don't. <laughs> that's the thing. We got, the funny shit was we, we was ain't like, feel like we did. Yeah, we didn't. That's what I'm saying. But so I guess like, the content and the the way we rhyme, you know what I mean? It was that energy. I'm known for my voice. He's known for his voice. You mm -hmm. know what I mean? Ike was a fucking brutality rapper. So was Ruck. Like, you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. So it was Did like, I get why now, looking back on it, yeah, I can see why a nigga would say that. Right. Yeah. It's that energy. It's that you energy. This shit was ill. Like, 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 we had, like, we, it's certain types of niggas in the streets. Right. You know what I'm saying? You get certain types of dudes, like, Every rapper you saw remind you of somebody you know. Right. Or somebody, like, like when you was younger, when Rakim and them came out, you know, they right. was grown ass dudes. So maybe they, maybe you ain't know a nigga, but you might have seen a drug dealer dude or somebody that reminded nah, you of Rakim and them. You Definitely. know what I mean? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So. That's the beat. It's like. By the time the 90s. Came in and you had that, that that you know that overflow of dope variety, right. dope rappers. Variety. You right. know what I'm saying? Like Facts. it was, it, it was, it was a bunch of dope. I love that ever. I love that ever. Dope, it's my favorite ever. Baby. Different Facts. motherfuckers. You know what I'm saying? Like Mob Deep, you had some dudes in your hood Facts. that remind. They were short. They was with the shit. Remember all they city? was hustling. Remember them niggas? Yeah, I remember them. I all remember them. Crew, remember them. I remember yeah, them. I remember them. All city. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. They, Yo, they... but like, but like, w one other thing though, especially like somebody like me who's like a, a historian, a super fan, like. Y'all, I never like heard anybody say, "Yo, we want beef with boot camp," and they was beefing with like everybody was beefing with everybody. It's that and boot camp like was like the earlier, most bitch. respected. You know yeah. what I'm saying? I like like y'all was cool energy, with Big, y'all was cool with Pac. I mean, we you had know? issues with Big though. Yeah, we did. Like you know what I'm saying? Like that happened, but it wasn't a thing where dudes said we want beef with boot camp. It was some shit where it was a misunderstanding and shit right. started. You know, you know, shit just it was actually something. Mm -hmm. Right. It wasn't just like fuck them niggas over there for no reason or whatever. Right. But yeah, I mean. We had a little, yeah. That was that was basically the most notable. We had a small, back in the days with mystical and shit. Mystical, mm -hmm. um, when mystical first came out, he had some like he he had a crew before he was down with No Limit. He mm -hmm. had a crew. They was called Boot Camp Click. That oh, was, word! Yeah, I didn't know that. Yeah. That was problematic. Yeah, you know I bet it saying? was. So, Hell yeah! I remember that. So one nah, time, he had a crew. Yeah, niggas wore camouflage and shit. It's Army crazy. Fatigue. Boot Army camp tag. click. Boot and he, tag. he had to know because they was our way before mystical, nigga. You had to know mystical. So, That's why he was moving funny. That's why. So, yeah. Okay. So yeah, we um he stopped that eventually. Like I mean, you know, he respected it. I mean, like we we did, I never spoke to him, but I tried to get at him one day. Yeah. I couldn't get to him, but you know, it wasn't nothing. Like it wasn't much of nothing. His security. I was. I was <laughs> <laughs> I was, I was, I was, I try, I, 
Diamond D told me years later, he was like, you remember how you got on stage? Because they was on stage. Right, right. I was like, I, I, the stairs? I don't know. He was like, nigga, you climbed across my whole back. <laughs> <laughs> so what? Oh, like, you, what? That's when a nigga got that straight tunnel vision. Yo, that's that. I know that feeling. I know when, when it's on and you got that, it's on site with a nigga and you see him, it's Sorry. like nothing. It's like a juggernaut kind of feeling, cause ain't mm -hmm. nothing in front of you gonna stop me from really getting there. Right, yeah. but I got stopped. It was they had a big security nigga. He just grabbed my shit up, wrapped me up. That's when you get snatched out the tunnel. Like, huh? <laughs> 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 like, what happened? Oh, oh, yeah. <laughs> oh okay. <laughs> <laughs> it was big as shit. He had an afro and shit. <laughs> Yeah, like, hey, hey, where the hell you go? Yeah, you know, I'm like, I'm that's like, when shit goes, shoot, that's <laughs> when that record skip, like, shoot. <laughs> oh, shit, what happened? Oh, nah, nah, I'm chilling, I'm I was like, yo, nah, but I was, I was, yo, I was on one. He was like, he was like, yo, what you, I'm like, yo, get off me, fat boy, I will fuck you up. Like, I was on one, I'm like, I, I promise you, let me go, I will beat the shit out of you. <laughs> like, hey, yo, like, dude, right, dude in the chat right. said that um he had called himself Boot Camp Clip because New Orleans was the boot and mil and he and like, Mr. Cool used to be a, he he used to be in a, in, a, in a service or some yeah, shit like yeah, that. Yeah, the army was. Yeah, I, niggas all wore the, wild dog look, tags. No, yeah, all of that yeah. made sense, but we was here first. Nah, that's a fact. And that, it's it just a whole was, fact. and it, it just was what it was. And even if we wasn't here first, right? Let's just say we 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 start we came up with the idea the same day. Right. Let's just say that, right? What we gonna do? Right. You understand what I'm saying? Right. That it's hip hop. What we gonna do? We gonna clash. At some point, we gonna clash. Yeah, definitely. Us. So that's just that was just what that was about, and right. it wasn't really nothing no more serious than that. Like I didn't get to punch nobody. You know what I'm saying? Right. If you if if anybody exagger if anybody tell you I ran them if I they they exaggerating. Right. right. I caused this. I I. <clears throat> I made a, 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 a otherwise comfortable scene uncomfortable. <laughs> you know right. what I mean? Right. But I was stopped before I was able to do anything to Brownsville. Right. You know what I mean? And, <laughs> you know what I mean? And I, I just, I like, I never even had a conversation with him after that. Like, right. it just, that just was what it was. I just knew that they wasn't doing that no more. And then he was down with No Limit. Years later, right? You know what I mean? Like mm -hmm. I, I didn't, I hadn't heard from him or nothing. Get on the floor, <laughs> the man right here. Shout out to Mystical. He did his thing. He came in the game, got his money, and then I he never liked Mystical. I ever. mean, nobody. That wasn't our speed, mm -hmm. B. I mean, but he did his thing. Whether we liked him or not, he came in the game, did his thing, then he did the dumb shit and went to jail. And yeah, hey, shit like that. So, yeah, you know, yeah. I did. Well, anyway, what's up, Rock? Yeah, I got a couple questions for Rock. What's the like? How? What's yeah. the state? Like, what's the, what's the nah. state of? Uh, what's the state? <laughs> <laughs> Don't get them all hyped up. Like, what the fuck y'all niggas about to do? Like, what's the state of the uh, the, uh, the crew right now? Like, what's up? What's what, how do you you keep in touch with the Rang? Any of these other? Yeah, 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 yeah. How y'all? Yeah, yeah. How y'all? Um, how y'all now? I almost had the Rang drive me out here today. Uh, right? Shout out like, my nigga the Rang. He was like, I, he had some shit to do, but um, that's my nigga. Um. Every, I spoke to Starang today. I spoke to Steel today. Oh, for um, sure. I haven't spoke to Louisville in a minute. Louis, I'm about to ask about Louisville son. is boot camp's gypsy. Like, he always has been. Like, moving around. Yeah, like, Louisville lived. I heard he was living in Atlanta or he, something like right, that. Look, hold on. Let me, let me, let me. Because, <laughs> you know, I go, I go, I ain't going to lie. I used to down, see Louisville in, like, grind time. Remember when grind time had grind time Atlanta? Mm-hmm. And I used to see him like in the footage. Like he used to be judges. They used to judge battles and mm -hmm. shit. He used to be some of the judges yeah. in the Atlanta battle. I'm and like, oh, the fuck have we been down lived there? in Chile. Wow. He lived in Chile. Who the fuck moves from <laughs> Brownsville C -H -I -L -E. to Chile, nigga? Who does that? But did it, was there a woman involved? Probably. Yeah, that's probably why. <laughs> like, like, that's that's who that's knows? That's like, I, don't, I ain't never Chile, go there to Chile, visit Chilean the nigga. women. Right. So you probably have one of them. The nigga lived in Chile. The nigga lived in Canada. This nigga lived in Canada after, like, like, I just got in Canada for the first time last year, like in July, for the first I time remember that. in 20 years. Because they used to let me in, but it was always drama. Like, right. sometimes they wouldn't, sometimes they would, but it right. was, it was Every time it was a struggle. Right. The last time I tried was in 07 when it was just a, it was the worst time of all of them, a whole nother long story. So I was right. like, fuck right, this. Right, right, right. I ain't trying no more. Right. But the time before that, me and Louisville, we, 
all the whole boot camp went. We went through there together. I got, I went through. You ain't nah. You out of here. I, I'm sit, I'm now. I'm just sitting there. With, I guess they said, uh, we all right. He needs some company. How many of them? They looked at me and Louisville. Our IDs got the same building. You know, we from the same building. Right. Right. You. <laughs> <laughs> That's what it felt like. They Damn. They <laughs> like, all right, this nigga know he's out. He already know it's a hit and miss for him. Right. You're not going. I'm like, all right, fuck it. I just took my lumps. I'm like, all right, everybody. It's like, and I'm sitting there waiting. Next thing I know, I see Louisville come. <laughs> 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 And stay out, right? <laughs> they threw his ass out. <laughs> and stay out. <laughs> he gonna get you some company, nigga. You wait. You wait right there, right? Here my boy come out. <laughs> That's hilarious. Louisville lived in Atlanta. I mean, not Atlanta, in Canada after that. What? How yes. you get back in? I don't know, son. But I'm like, yo, how the fuck? Hey. Like they 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 dubbed me one more one good time after that, and they dubbed me so bad I ain't tried no more for like what was that oh seven to now to this this year wow. last year just passed. I was like twelve oh, years. Fuck that. Damn. Word. So you ain't see that nigga in a minute. They dubbed me bad, son. They threatened to lock me up. Yeah, they did that to me in Canada. Though. I did. I had to get a party. I had to pay money for a part in to go do a battle when I went to battle Arsenal. I went through a whole rigmarole to get a motherfucking part in and I got a case that wasn't never classified, meaning when it happened, it was on the cusp of me being an adolescent or an adult. So it never got classified. So when I asked about it, they said it was never, they, it was hard for, for them to expunge it, it had to be classified. For me to classify it, I had to reopen the case. And, and, and I had to get a I lawyer. I said, nah, don't reopen shit. shit. <laughs> I said, nah. I said, the any way around this, they said it's, cause I was trying to get it expunged. Mm -hmm. And they said, you can't get it expunged, but what you can do is get a pardon, which is a temporary letter saying that you good, and show that to the people at the border. And I did that. They still held me for about eight hours though. But they finally came back and was like, God, you good. And I was just like, that's when I got in Canada to battle Arsenal. Word the moment, I had to go through it. And, that, and it cost about $750 to niggas, get the party. Niggas yeah. really think, you tell niggas you went to Canada, you went over here, you went over here on some rap shit, they like, oh, at least you get, that's so wonderful, you get to travel. Yeah, but Dude, you gotta go through a whole bunch of bullshit man, though. Listen, Especially B. when you niggas is ex felons and all that. Yeah, it's hard man, to go places, listen, B. Yeah. It's hard to go places. Shit is B. crazy, son. The last time they dubbed me in Canada, let me tell you what these fuckers did to me, right? I since since it, like I said, it was hit and miss from the first trip, right? So this time it had been miss, miss, miss for a little while, including that last time when they sent Louis home with me, right? I, um so I'm like, all right. They got a tour, we got a tour, boot camp got a tour coming. I'm like, they on, y'all gonna take the, y'all gonna drive in? I'm gonna fly in Dolo, right? Mm -hmm. I tried to finesse it. Tried to finesse it. I'm right, like, right, right. let me get away from the gang. Are you trying to come in Dolo? I'm saying, I went in Dolo. <laughs> and they still got With it. the turtleneck, the blazer. <laughs> <laughs> Looking like vampire in Brooklyn out the bitch. <laughs> you crazy as shit. <laughs> I think it's saying he had the blazer on. Corduroy slacks, nigga. Oh, my God. And they still denied you? Yes. Wow. And not only did they deny, this is, like I said, this was the worst one because the lady, she felt like I played her because I did, you know, in, in effect, I did, you know, she because she, she was feeling me. You know what I'm saying? I'm a pretty likable guy when I want to feel <laughs> shit, right? So, you know what I'm saying? This old white lady sitting there typing. I'm told I'm nice. I got my good smile on and shit. Right. Right? Fine selection of big words and shit. Right, right, right. right. So she's with, she's with all this shit I'm talking, and then she starts typing, and you know what they start, they be typing forever. That she typed. That's a bad sign. Type. That's a bad sign. Long, mad typing. That's a bad sign. Next, next thing I know, she just looked up a whole different lady. Like, it was like a whole, it was like she went down and put, <laughs> and put on another face. And came up, there wasn't no smile, no yeah. nothing. She's like, so what are you doing in our country? Wow. wow. But she's like, what are you really doing in our country? I'm like, what the? 
and then the bullshit began. So I feel like because she felt played, she they denied me with ketchup. You understand what I'm saying? Right. Like they put extras on the denial. Yo, where, why the fuck is Canada border so strict though? I I'd have been around this fucking world. I ain't never had no many, no problem, never, no other nowhere. fucking immigration border, tolerance. nothing. Nah, but son, it's not Canada they, though. So you know when they first deny you, it's like only like a partial denial. Like you could go over their head. Right? right, and they always tell you that, but nobody ever does that. You just so I'm like, fuck it. It was like six shows on the other side of this border. We gonna go. We gonna we gonna roll the dice, right? So Fucking money, man. <laughs> I roll the dice. Meanwhile, Louisville is inside where he got he ro- he got the boys out. He got up uh, the we got all kind of purple niggas out right. there. You no, know, they out there rolling out the purple carpet way. Like yo, you got through yet? I'm like, no. Stop calling me. My phone dying, and I can't charge my shit. Right, right, right. They right. on some bullshit. They don't want you to charge your phone. They don't want you on the phone. They don't right. want you on the phone. Word. Yo, that shit bullshit. crazy, b. All this bullshit. Then finally, they finally dub me. You know, the nigga come from upstairs, dub me. Right. Song, what up? Hot sun breeze, my nigga. It's, it's it's the whole next. It's nighttime now. Mm-hmm. It's damn near midnight. Right. They dub me and they start telling me about flights and prices. I'm like, what do you mean? Like, let's, nah, listen, they ain't make me pay. They put me on a free jump. You know what I'm saying back that's to. that's what they use. Look, look, this is what happens. I go say my first rodeo. I got attitude too. I'm like, <laughs> right, right. I'm like, yo, <coughs> pay for no flight. Y'all, y'all put me. He's like, no, not us. He's like, the airline that flew you here is their responsibility to fly you back, right. and they don't have any flights until the morning, and you can't. We not letting you out into the airport to wait. You understand what I'm saying? So we ain't gonna let you roam around we, do what you want to do. Right before. where you you we do yeah. have a maximum security cell, holding cell Get right the in the back, where you can stay f- until the morning if you. Oh, nah, hold on. What you said, those flights? What, 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 what you said? <laughs> what you said you got? Get the fuck out of here, man. Started. That's crazy. You know, I whooped the little magic up, got the fuck home, and they sent my luggage to Jamaica, my nigga. Get the yeah. fuck out Montego of here. Montego Bay. Dude, I never dude. even been to Jamaica. My luggage was. Wow. <laughs> That's crazy. <laughs> That's the fucking... The, the, the perils of travel in the world. That shit is fucking right. right. So boom, another question. As far as your music, like where, where's your, like what you doing with your music right now? And what's anybody else in the, in the camp? Is any, anything Yeah, you cool? said you got a bunch of shit going on. We yeah, talk about yeah, it. Yeah, um, I'm sitting here trying to roll this bro. Yeah, we can take calls. Bad. We can take just calls from anybody, like Skype calls. Not, not yet. Right? Video. Not yet. Um, well, I'm working on it. I got, a, I got this album with Ron Browse. That's what um a Harlem nigga. That's right. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Facts plus tax. Shout out Ron Brown. I just had to say that my form. I just had to say that. You know what I mean? Cause I'm a Harlem nigga living in Brooklyn now. They get right. me all the time. Yeah, swear, if you a Brooklyn nigga now. Yeah, right, Brooklyn got, nigga. They gonna got, give Harlem some kind of props. So I got Brooklyn tendencies. Yeah, yeah, I do. Know, I do. Know, whatever. You know what I'm saying? But um, we got. I'm working on multiple projects. It's the it's the the Rock First project. Uh-huh. That's the Ron Browns album there's the wilderness project that's the rock wilder project mm. doing an album with rock wilder this shit's stupid yeah you niggas need, need to come yeah, get on yeah, stop, yeah, yeah. stop playing with stop us playing man. Like, for hit real. my line hit, uh, hit that line stop playing Lord, with us man, we need to like, get on yo, that yo y'all shit yo <laughs> Yeah, we get busy. <laughs> yo, nah, 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 now, yo, real quick though, like nah, I be playing. What's the, what's the shit called? Started up. Started up. So yeah. I play that shit. I, I think my daughter know the lyrics to that. Shit. Yo, yeah. um, my nigga, I seen you I'm, was dropping a rock wilder shit, which is like, you know, that's like expected, like you know. But the Ron Brown shit to me, mm-hmm. like that's a little left field, right? Because he's known for like party music. Mm-hmm. You know what, what? What would that sound like? What is, is? Are you like? Have you been working on I it? Mean, or? You heard "Pay Me." Mm-hmm. That's a song over there. Okay. You know what I mean? But it's not all like that, though. Right. I mean, but it's just me, man. Like I mean, like people like Helter Skelter had a formula. You know what I mean? Like we we made action movie rap. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? Like, Yo, y'all dirt album though. 
I need to get. I need to listen to that Dirt album. That shit got me to back and forth from Myrtle Beach and said that Dirt album That's was fire. Up. That yeah. was that was the best version of Help the Skelter lyrically. The incredible on, rap on team. Dirt. Yeah, you I know know I mean? both of y'all niggas we was, was, was snapping. That yeah, shit was. Y'all was snapping. I, I, I love, I love, I love all of them. I love, no, I love, I love, them all I love too. Magnum Force. No, too. but that 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 album was produced. Which like one? Like dirt. dirt, dirt. Like dirt was like. Yeah, that was different, yo. Yeah, the you beats know, on that shit was retarded. Dirt was different. Yeah, like dirt. I mean, like I just felt like you know it was mm-hmm. me and Ruff was in the space where we was happy to be back in the studio together, and we was like, hey, look what I know how to do now. Right, you know what I'm saying. Yeah, Sean right. lives on. Sean the mother. On. Shout out, my nigga. You know I mean? I'm um, not Brad. I'm not Brad. <laughs> but um, Sean lives here's on. the thing, right? I got multiple albums. There's the Ron Browse album, right? right? The, the Rock Wilder album. There's an album with my man Archetype from Boston. There's a the, well, that's an EP. There's an EP with my man Big Ape from Amsterdam. Mm. Called, it's called Chronicles of the Most High. Nice. Right? It's all it's all weed bars. It's it's, it's all. It's, I need it's, to be on that. It's too. done already. Oh right, it's man, done. I got it's a done. weed verse to go that right shit now. Is stupid. Um, what is what else? Um, the, the archetype album is called Half Man, Half a Monster. Uh-huh. The EP. Um, I gotta do this Crownsville EP with Rusty Jukes. Mm. You know what I mean? Shout out to my nigga Rusty. Rustoli. Shout out to Rusto- Rusty nigga Jukes. Slick, yeah. the ruler. Yeah. Um, nah, nice. yeah. So. It's a lot of shit we doing. We, me, I spoke to Steel today. We definitely wanted to get started on the new boot camp album. Okay, you know what I mean. I, that was gonna be my next question right there. Yeah, it's he just it's so jokes. much. I that nigga's son, wow, big now. His son rapping. Yeah, his son is. is he be ad libbing, yeah. Rusty, on stage and all. <laughs> I love that. Damn, I I wish me and always... I wish my son wasn't that far from me in age. Mm-hmm. So he definitely be on stage with me ad libbing me. I yeah. always love, always like watching Rusty just come up with his son. I like, always love seeing that about That's him. That's fine. Like, I love that. Know, he always had his son with him in his videos. His son on right stage. there ad-libbing Fact. with him. I love it. Know what I mean? Like, as a little nigga, like, he had to be like seven, eight. He right there with his pop say his mm-hmm. pop. I'm like, yo, that's yeah. Yo, I actually just seen something today with Rusty Jukes. He was in a car. He was freestyling in a car. Oh, yeah? With somebody. It was like one of them YouTube dudes yeah. that like do the Rapping in the yeah, car yeah, thing. Yeah, 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 yeah. I know what you talking about. Killed that shit. Rock did yeah. one of those too. Yeah, I did one of those. Yo. Spit in the whip shit. So, yeah. Rock. What's your first song you ever recorded with Rock? Do you remember? Um, I think it was a song called The Ill Political. It was two songs. I think we recorded Ill Political first, but we recorded them the same day. Right. Um, the other one was called The Wicked Tag Team. Still remember them? Oh, I would love to hear them shit. Yo, I got an old ass song from you and this group that I used to fuck with back in the day called Foul Play. Oh nah, those are, I still know. I look, look, Tommy Gunn. Facts. Tommy Gunn shot Millie um videos like like son is a dope video director. Oh like, yeah. Like a few a few of my, a few of my, you know my baby bro Millie. Right. Tommy Gunn shot a few of those videos. Oh, that's what's up. Yeah, he um. Were they from Seattle or yeah, something from like that? Tacoma, right. Tacoma, Washington. Yeah, oh, right okay. next to Seattle. Yeah, be, I remember them yeah. back in the day fucking with my nigga Howie McDuffie. Yeah. He had us fucking with them. We we met up with them a couple of times, mm-hmm. and they used to. They played this song. They had a little demo tape that they were going around, and one of them had you <coughs> on it. I was like, oh. Bars. Facts. Word up. Facts. Is it me you loving? Are you sure? Remember that yeah, shit? Yeah, yeah. Killing me, kill, son. Cause I'm feeling yeah. heat like I'm in war. That shit. Remember that shit, right? I remember that shit. That shit was fire back in the days. Yeah, that all that shit was fire. Yo, how did, how did all of y'all come together, though, the boot camp? Where did y'all all meet? I know everything's Brooklyn. You know I'm a Harlem nigga. You know what I mean? I'm in Brooklyn now. but well, some of it started in Manhattan. What? I mean, I'm pretty sure Tech met Steel in Manhattan because they went to high school. They went to they went to graphic communication. Arts. Facts, facts. Okay. You know what I mean, we used to call it printing the old old heads. Right. And and Techno, a couple of my Harlem niggas too from uptown, hard mm-hmm. body. I got, I got, I got, I got. Shout to Tech. You be on Linux in front of ninety five, nigga. I know. <laughs> <laughs> I know, nigga. Tech don't like it when I when he don't like the fact that I compare bad style niggas to Harlem niggas all the time. He get mad when I say, I'm like, so what, son? Like, how you gonna nah, get that? Nah, different, son? B. Nah, son. But me I'm being like, from Willoughby, but and me look, being son, from Willoughby between something and truth is nah, definitely a I, difference. I know yo. they different, son, but I feel That's like a different I Roosevelt like, projects. Nah, but look, but look, but look. But look, but look, but look, though, right? Because I feel like Bed-Stuy is a certain kind of fly mm-hmm. that remind me of, like, 
right. you know, like of of Harlem. You know, it's 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 Manhattan niggas. Every Manhattan nigga ain't a Harlem nigga. Of course, course. Harlem niggas of course. is a certain kind of fly. You understand right, what I'm saying? Right. Facts plus tax. And, and it's all respect, <laughs> right? So, you know, one day we had a we was a yo, facts plus we was tax. We was in we was in we was yo we was in we was in the park arguing at the top of our lungs one day. It's footage floating around the IG somewhere of this, of this shit, right? But at the end of the day, I said, it ain't no coincidence, mm -hmm. right, that Biggie and Puffy link the way they link, right? It ain't no coincidence that it's not just them. It was Jay and Dame, too. You understand what I'm saying? Like, it ain't no coincidence what I'm trying to tell you. You understand you know what, what I'm saying? I ain't never even think about no shit like that. But just say. There's an appeal factor uh -huh. there. I can say for me personally, being from a, I'm a Harlem nigga, you know what I mean? Born and raised, and being a nigga that live in Brooklyn now, I, I can feel a difference, but you know, I guess I it's just me. I'm different. just, as, it's definitely a difference, definitely. definitely. I, I definitely can see the different kind of niggas mm -hmm. too. Like, yeah. oh, the niggas I used to be around, now the niggas I be around, like, okay, yeah, there's definitely a difference. But, mm -hmm. but I still resonate with both, like, mm -hmm. But that's what, I, that's what I was saying earlier. Like, we know somebody like, like, like when me and Ruck came out. Like, like I said, when Mob Deep came out, you knew some niggas like Mob Deep from around your way that they resonated. Right. right. Like me and Ruck resonated to a certain type of nigga. Like you understand right. what I'm saying? Like it's a certain, it's a certain, it was <laughs> yeah, a certain I, demographic uh, that wasn't being spoken for. Right. And it was buck wild ass. Small time robbery, crack you over your fucking head. <laughs> you understand what I'm saying? So, like, so. like that, like, like, the, like those dudes. Like, you know mm -hmm. what I'm saying? Like, senseless violence. You know what I mean? Like, that's the kind of shit we was just since, Damn. just, just, since, just like gorillas in the mist type. Just, just niggas in the jungle on, on, on that, that animal mentality type yeah, you shit. You definitely you know spoke. What I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. yeah I guess and that so. was that, that was, was when me and Ruck were out of the boot camp. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Yeah, y'all all definitely had a different type. Like you had like the rain and yeah, everybody had Louisville their own style. had their own style. And, and son, what's son name? Top, top dog. dog, top dog. Shout out to my nigga Top Dog. Yeah, That's yeah, my OGC. guy. You a funny nigga, so you a funny nigga on the ground. Yeah. Shout out my nigga Top Dog. <laughs> Now everybody had their own signature style, you mm -hmm. know what I'm saying? Right. So that's what I, that's what dope. Y'all y'all could come together on some on the same type of, type of shit, but y'all all had your own different type of style, right? Which was dope about y'all. So that shout out to that. That's what was fire. Rock always had that standout. Mm -hmm. You was always the standout back then. Always to me, like you and Rock. Y'all <laughs> two was always the standout, and and like but, Buckshot came out with yo, who got the props. And that was my shit. Like, oh, this shit, that, that beat was the, I used to freestyle to that beat mm. all the time. This is back in the days when singles came out with the instrumental speaking one. Of that, Remember that shit? Home, but speaking of that, yo, you know what's so, yo, you know what's how, how ill, how we all linked though, how we used to be with these niggas, with Evil D and Calliope Studios, how we used to spend the night in Calliope Studios in Midtown, and that nigga, yo, I got, I got the crazy yo, memory of you. Crazy. You probably don't even remember it was me. And this is back in the days, right? I was chilling with um, with with LES niggas with Dirty Work in them, and everybody used to always freestyle in Washington Square Park, right? It was a bunch of ciphers. I think it was like a weed fest or some shit going on, mm -hmm. and, and it was Washington Square Park. Niggas was out there freestyling, right? And we out there rapping. Up walk this nigga, <laughs> mean as hell, dreads, mean face. He just burst in, started rapping. Now he's standing right. You burst in right here. When you moved, my man Lavi, he was there, he moved. And you stood right next to me, right? You rapping. My nigga Troy here, Goya, my nigga Karim. We all in a circle, you rapping. As soon as you stop rapping, you turned and you walked and you bumped me. I was like, and everybody was like, yo, that's the hell this girl's the nigga. I was like, yo, this nigga, what's, what's up with this nigga right here? Like, I was ready to pop, like, yo. Everybody was like, yo, this chill, that's that rapper dude. That's the, that's Helter the Skelter, Helter the Skelter. Then I look, I was like, yeah, but this nigga just, why he do all that, though? That shit, shit rubbed me wrong, Rock. I ain't gonna lie, but you did kill a cypher, though. I ain't gonna, he came in and spit some shit in me. He came in, boom, rapped and walked, and on his walk out, he just showed it me. Bang! I was like, oh, what? <laughs> I was, okay, I got you. I was feeling yeah. myself. Yeah, yeah you were. those days, though, especially in the studio, we used to stay up in a Calabria. Evil D always came up there. Troop was up there all the time. I remember Evil like, D used to talk about Calliope. 
Oh, yeah. son, that yeah, shit should be that crazy. We spent the night in that shit. We spent nights yeah. in that shit. Yeah. And then yeah. it was, the studio was so big, like, that was like, that shit had different rooms, like, on some like, other shit. Like, that shit was wow big. So it was like. And me and I got, we used to quad when that Pac shit happened. Oh, no, word. Yeah. Yeah, we, we was in another right studio. Upstairs. That's crazy. That's fact. Fair, we man. wasn't in that studio, but yeah. Quad had mad studio right. in the I building. That building. We I was know. on like, yeah, the, recorded, what floor we was on? Like recorded, the sixth man. floor? Or my, yo, matter of fact. Boy, when Pac got shot, we was there. I my was album, um, my first, my very first album, my very first solo album that I recorded was called Planet Rock. I got it, um, niggas been telling me to put that shit out. Put that shit out, put that shit out. Like, so I did that shit. Nah, I, what I did was, I, um, I op- I put it on I op- I started a Patreon account and I put it on this. Oh, okay. You know what I'm saying? But it's like 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 when I went I had to dig this shit up. Like, you know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. Like dig this shit was all analog. Some of these shits ain't the <laughs> final mixes. None of this shit, but this is what I I dug it up and I was listening to this shit. Well, and that, oh. Son, this shit took me on a whole nother journey. So mm-hmm. what I'm a nostalgic the, journey. Right, right, like, like, like I got a homeboy, right? My man, he was he was my man Ready Rock. Salute to my nigga Ready, right? Ready. He was like, yo, when I was when I was looking for that album to put it on Patreon, uh-huh. I caught cause he made one of the he made the song for the he made the beat for the intro song. And I'm asking him, I'm like, yo, son, do you have Welcome to My World? He was like, nah, son, that shit was in the ASR and the Wooty Wap Wap. Alright, I'm looking for this shit, right? He was like, yo, when I told him what I was up to, he was like, he said, my nigga. He was like, when you find that album, <laughs> he was like, no, it was when I found it and I called him. Well, he called me back. He was like, yo, I can't find. It. I was trying. I'm like, nah, I found. It. He was like, you found it? I'm like, yes, I found. It. He was like, hey, listen, do me a favor. It was when we was getting ready to go to Chile just now, right? A few months ago. He was like, listen to that album. He said, put that shit on your phone. He said, plug that shit up. He said, you got headphones for your phone? You want them niggas don't be having headphones and shit. He said, get you some headphones. Right. Listen to that shit on the plane. Fall asleep, listen to that shit. And hopefully wake up feeling like you felt when you recorded that shit. That's dope. I was like, huh? That's not that's the type of shit I be on. I, I listen to a lot of my old shit. So right. keep myself in tune. So uh, here's the my thing. Name. That's a fact. Here's the thing. When I listen, I'm as I'm listening to this shit, you know, this is rock right after Magnum Force. Mm. Oh, what? Yeah. Oh, you was on some other shit. This is like rock, like a year or two after Magnum Force. Oh, you was wild. Mm. <laughs> Yo, I ain't never heard the album, man. You fine. I need to hear that. With money, yo. Like I had just signed the solo <coughs> deal, right? Shit was crazy. Like shit was different. So I'm list I'm listening to this shit and 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 so so I just came up with this dope idea. I'm like, I'm every month, like on for the for the Patreon niggas, like every month I drop a song. You know what I'm saying? Right. For that album. shit. Do right. that. You know that's what I'm saying? Yeah, do like, that's that, how it's man. going. You know what I'm You've saying? You've been doing so, it already. Yeah, that's how that's okay. how it's been going. So patreon.com slash rockness monster. Right. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, I hear that. Do and, that. And, and and I got other kind of gifts, all kind of other shit. Like all yeah, I hear kinda, that. all kind of exclusive gems. Subscribe nice, to that nice. Patreon, Rockness Monster. I'm dropping right. a single a month for the rest of this year. The monster show, monthly. Right. But hold on. I gotta give a shout out to your man Kango though. That shit fire. Shout out to your man Red Kango. That shit fire. Yeah, classic. <laughs> classic. Hey yo, fire. um, yo, real quick too, I wanted to ask you too, like Yo, what's your thoughts on like, like yo, you were like one of the first people, to, in my opinion, to like use your voice as an instrument. That's fire. You feel me? Like you, mm-hmm. MOP, like, mm-hmm. like, mm-hmm. and then Shout nowadays, like, me. you know, the mumble Sadat rappers X. are doing that, but they they don't have the lyrics to match it. It's just, you know, melodies that's, like that's funny. You like said yo, that you just said that too. I mean, look, yeah, like, 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 like how did that even like come about? As you doing that shit, that's using your you voice. That. You know, because that's what rock, like when I listen to rock, that's what I look for. I mean, well, I I don't know. I kind of, I think that kind of, I don't know when it started, but I want to say that it was a boot camp thing. Mm -hmm. You know Mm -hmm. what I mean? Like, before that, like, you know, like, as a kid, like, I got my style from five places. Five places, eight MCs. Mm. Kane. Mm Mm-hmm. Rock him, G Rat, K R S One. Okay. 
NWA. Facts. Easy Q, Ren, Dre. Facts. You understand what I'm saying? So that that was those were the original ingredients in my style. You know what I'm saying? My flow, my temperament. You know what I mean? The fact that I'm so like like the NWA just showed me I I was allowed to be pissed off mm -hmm. as I really because I was a pissed off kid. Right. You know what I'm saying? But I didn't rap that way. I didn't know you could until NWA showed me that. Right. You know what I'm saying? So NWA got me slapped. Mm. My mother slapped the shit out of me for playing. <laughs> She swallowed it. P stacks. What up, homie? Yeah, Yo. Right? But but what but but what you know from boot camp, you know, when when as boot when boot camp formed, we started to influence each other. Mm -hmm. Like if you listen to Buckshot on Who Got the Props, he sounds completely different on the whole rest of that album. You know what I mean? Right. It's a whole different laid back. That was the influence of, of the mini. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? <clears throat> So I think Buck, like between Buckshot and Smith and Wesson and Top Dog infusing the reggae yeah, shit, you know what I mean? Like they, that they became the biggest, you know, uh, pushers of the yeah. of the melody. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Like the biggest, the, like that that influence was theirs. You know what I mean? And I adopted it, being, you know, so. That's where I think it came from. And you know, just over the years, like even till this, to, till this day, I'm still trying to say doper shit than I said yesterday. Mm -hmm. So, you know, um, I just refuse to let anything go. Like, I don't wanna add something to my toolbox and take mm -hmm. something out. Mm -hmm. All right. Stay I'm keeping all. I'm. I'm, keep I'm a hoarder. Stay in your you lane. understand what I'm, <laughs> I'm I'm hoarding all this shit. You understand what I'm saying? Because I, I don't never want to do or because yeah. I, I I'm always going to do and. It's right. not going to be or. You know what I Got mean? Got you. That's that's hard. Quick question: Whatever happened to Five FT? Five is chilling. He be yeah, chilling. He's um he all over the new Black Moon album. Yeah, yeah. Five back on the first Black Moon album, like five he rapping. Did, yeah, yeah, yeah. That was the thing. He rapped, but he didn't rap. He be all at the all time the events back in the days. You know what I mean? But now he on his rap shit. Okay. Okay, I got a question. Mm -hmm. We gonna now we gonna get into our world with you. Would you ever battle? Right? Or what would it take for you to battle? Cause I think you can. You be having some shit, and I think you got a song. I'm gonna play the video for, and in this song, you do what a lot of these battle rappers be doing now. Well, would I ever battle? I can't. I say never. Say never. Like you can't force my. I, I mean, I'm hip hop, so mm -hmm. you can't challenge me and expect me to. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, right. Fifty thousand. Well, well, hold up. First of all, let me say this. Yeah, like, here we go. Like, I, I think that a lot of rappers. I consider you industry, even yeah, though you down to earth industry. Mm -hmm. Like I've seen you at multiple events. Like you understand. What I, battle rap is? Listen, I'm asking this question I'm because I know this man. Mm -hmm. uh, under, uh, for the past yeah. couple years, I, I've gotten to know this brother, mm -hmm. and I hear him rap. I hear the way I'm he saying, put his bars together. You know, and as a battle rapper, if we take away the beat and let this, all he got to do is get comfortable on stage to get his. I know he. I think he could do it. Yeah, but I'm saying he's like not to say he's a student, but he like he been to crazy. events like he. He's seen, like, he knows what it takes. Oh, no. Nah, you know? I, I his voice like, very, versus his I voice. I know very well. Crazy. Yeah. I know, I mean, that would I be watch, fucking let me tell you stupid. Something. I watch so much battle rap. You know what I mean? I don't watch everybody. I don't know. It's so many motherfuckers now. It's mm -hmm. always been so many motherfuckers. Facts. Since, since mm -hmm. like, ever since, since ever since it's been a smack and a grind time, it's always been a lot of motherfuckers that it's been a certain amount of motherfuckers that fly under my radar. Mm -hmm. right, you know what I mean? Right, right. But Rock this, versus Lloyd Banks. <laughs> <laughs> That's funny. You know, Banks been trying to get a bad. Banks, he been making tweets. He been trying to he get been tweeting. I, Banks, been, Banks I been kill Lloyd Banks. Banks. I kill Banks. Let me tell y'all something, B. I don't think I he ready. Like, he ain't ready for what we do. I just feel like in in all reality, like 
I know that it ain't no fucking that it ain't no walk in the park. You know what I'm saying? Right. I got a lot of respect for it. You know what I mean? And I don't know that my memory can uphold the challenge. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. Like, like I got years <coughs> of songs that I remember, right? <coughs> On every like like and every time you record new shit, mm-hmm. like for a new album, you put out a new you have to retain some of that because you gotta perform some of that. Right. I don't know all of the songs. Like, I couldn't perform all of Nocturnal right now, but four songs off of Nocturnal, I, I got you. Right. Got you. you know what yeah, I mean? Yeah, 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 Three got songs you. off of Magnum Force, I got you. Got I you. mean, you could do off of Dirt. Dirt, about, probably about five. Nice. You understand what I'm that's saying? That's all you need about for a performance. Six, you ain't got to do the whole. Right. I'm just saying, like, yeah. you know, like, I, like that's I good money. You know, that, that I would love to hear y'all do what's that shit? But, but we are the little champion sound. Don't come, but we are the little champion sound. Oh, oh, what's that? Bye, bye. Bye, bye. That's yeah, boy they do that yeah. all the time. Yeah, they do that's 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 all the time. But, but like, but I could do more too. songs. Like, I, like I'm saying, like, I could, I could, I could raise those numbers. But I gotta rehearse right quick. Like right. I gotta, I gotta go through them in my mind. Right. I mean, that's what all and, of us. Right, 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 right. So, so, but then you take those, those three mandatory What's albums, right? Like I have to, but those certain songs I gotta know on contact, cause a nigga, I might pop up somewhere and they be like, yo, you got music? I'm like, no. They be like, well, I got this. I'm like, fuck it. You understand right, what I'm right, saying? Like, right. and I, and I gotta bust it down, right? But, you know, if it's a prepared show, yeah, yeah. If we, if we gotta show us today. <laughs> if we got a show uh, 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 Thursday, right? I can have those whole. I can have all three, of, uh, all three of those albums memorized, mm-hmm. right? But on top of that, like or whatever I need to have memorized from all three, you'll of those be ready. Albums, basically, right? I'll yeah, be ready, right? But on top of that, I got all of this solo shit right. too. You understand what I'm saying? Locked in. And, like I gotta and and every time you put out a new you understand what I'm saying? So and then I got I got bars that I got just in case niggas want me to rap. You understand what I'm right. saying? All of this shit so that that I gotta know because you know right. my, like I can't that's a fact. I can't go to the radio, like I can't go to like if I go to to to, to like uh K Slay or something. Yeah, K Slay want me to rap probably. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? He probably want me to rap. S- sway in the morning. You know what I'm saying? Sway yeah. want me to sway. Yeah. Sway want they, me to rap. They want you to do five fingers to death and you know all that. Like, yeah, 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 like they want me to rap, so I need to have bars for that. Right. You know what I'm saying? I have this, you know, the the the, the recording of my recording artist career in the front. So, and it calls and it pulls every day. You know what I mean? So. In order for me to, I would, I have to dedicate time, like for real, for you real, have to, to re- really recalculate your yeah, whole like mindset. I, like I can't, like I gotta memorize these three rounds. You know what I'm saying? That are longer than the verses that I be writing. Longer right. than the song, right? You understand right. what I'm saying? Like so, yeah. it's, it's just, and and then after that, I can't use them no more. Yeah, I'm not really. I'm not much. feeling that. I'm not feeling that. Right. Y'all. Pretty much, pretty I ain't much. feeling that. Quick quick, I ain't another, feeling that. Another quick Welcome question. to my world. I ain't feeling that. God. Have you ever wanted to do a song with a certain artist, like established artist, that you were able to do, or like this is another song you want to do with, like say for example, like a Q-tip or something? You ever wanted to do a song like Q-tip or whatever? Or um, I wasn't able to. What that I was able to, or I wasn't able to. Yeah, like both. Well. I mean, I got to do songs with some artists that I wanted to do joints with, and a lot. It's you know, it's tons of dudes out there that I want to work with that I haven't gotten the chance to, and some that I probably won't ever get the chance to. Name you know the ones that you that you work with that you wanted to work with. Um, Dog Pound was exciting for me. Facts. Oh um, my, that was fire. I was just um, about to say that. Yeah. And that was the ill mixture to yeah. me. You and Buck and yeah. Corrupt and Dad, yeah. that was crazy. Yeah, Method Man was dope the first time. Shout out Meth. Yeah. Right? The second time, the second and the third time, is it, it became, you know, just more, it, it became different. Brotherly. You know? it's, it's your brother and shit, yeah. you know what I'm right. saying? But the first time, like, 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 I was a big, like, Method Man, Red Man, and, and they, those are two other artists that I learned from, you know, but, that was after, you right. know, I was already, this machine was already built. Right. You know what I'm saying? I learned from them niggas too. You know what I mean? So it was like easy. Yeah. Mm-hmm. So like, 
But so, but when you when you first meet a nigga and you that you really a fan of, mm-hmm. and he really a fan of you too, it's a different type of feeling. Right it's here. a different kind of energy. Right, 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 right. Like, right. You know what I mean? And I always say like me and Meth, like like niggas like them, like we like us, like we from a certain planet. We right. got that buck full. Energy, mm-hmm. yeah. You so know, once we what in the so, same room together with yeah. that, that type yeah, of beat, yeah, that's yeah, yeah. And we got, and we got all of this ridiculous it admiration happens. and respect for each other. It happens, and you find mm-hmm. out it's mutual. It's just, oh man, just roll the weed. Um, right, turn the beat on. Yeah. You know what I'm that's saying? It. Like, Kick back. It's gonna yeah. be fun. You know what I mean? Hey yo, play this, play that repeat video, B. This is that video I'm talking about. Where I think this is what battle rappers be doing now. You know what I'm talking? Play that video, huh? Repeat? Yep. Niggas ain't poppin', niggas pop a lot of shit, pop a lot of pills I tell my bitch pop that pussy, somebody shot and kill I'm a magician with these words, David Copperfield You stay trickin' on these birds, dry Copperfield Real eyes, real lies, real lies I don't know, I know what paralyzed could get you paralyzed Pronto, but I can't say paralyzed Cause my freedom wasn't paralyzed Niggas get sent to paradise over a paradise when the paramedics, when the paramedics operating where your head and your chest is a badge of a witness. Still sorry for you, it's too bad you're a witness. I don't know what's worse than niggas with the badge of a witness. I ain't giving no passes, I'm no point guard. Point guard out, he'll get the point guard or a knife point. God, I'm on point guard in the scene. At this point, I'm guard on the scene. Ain't no point guard in the shit, my monster. Be. How many times I gotta say it to you? How many ways I gotta say it for you? Nigga, I ain't playing with you. How many times I gotta say it to you? And everybody a man call you on speaker Let you say goodbye to your man It's a mean business and I mean business It's out of my hand This is war and this shit gon' be lit Till you war the fuck out Like the funny looking ass kicks you war If you don't be long then it won't be long Well, kinda sorta cause it's gon' be blown Listen, I'm nobody's fan but I'm cooler than AC Ultimate rider OJ, I'm AC Not the gamble you wanna take, take that to AC Niggas fighting the claim king, I'm the AC I'm the one, win some, lose some I already won, won yourself Fuck out of here, you already done, done, done You was just a feeling, the feeling is great drug you No penicillin, my penicillin, you're fake Fuck out of here How many times I gotta say it to you? How many ways I gotta say it for you? Nigga, I ain't playing with you How many times I gotta say it to you? How many ways I gotta say it for you? Nigga, I ain't playing with you How many times I gotta say it to you? How many ways I gotta say it for you? From I and the lady Don't make me repeat myself I got soldiers but I bang my I've been telling y'all niggas that that's all. I ain't even gotta say much for you niggas. Just remember, when your ass fall to the ass fall, just remember it's your dumb ass fall. That all, that all, that all. In case of emergency, break glass hustle. I'm near, yeah, I said I'll never be back. Fuck you, I do what I gotta. Cool the Matata, do the Marada, school the Empire, dark side of the force, Luke, I'm your father. Raised you little snot nose as pot roasting. I showed you niggas fly broke shit. You got shows about fly hoes and Versace and Prada clothes, cause I put the fly camouflage, I owe niggas. These streets gon' pay me one way or another I'ma have these streets going crazy Ask them who the greatest is, these streets don't say me That's whack, but they know when these streets don't play me Bet that If I'm not top five, I'm the best Rapper alive that's really about that life Let's argue, such a such a real nigga, I rap better Any nigga you think rap better, mad feathers Niggas get smacked and jacked, set up and tell I don't get raw, then I don't rap ever 
We all did crime for that fast shadow loop. They did time. I ain't do a year. I do that better too. And I have hella goons. I don't need them around to protect me. But I don't bring them around to protect you. Stupid. Thank me. Want me to change? Make me. Top of New York minus the frost. The flakes let me be great. Same speech I say on the beat. I say on the streets. I say to my seed. I'm saying this is me. I'm saying these fakers fake. They say what they say cause it's heat. Man, you niggas about as dangerous as we. Niggas look like you can't fight. Rap like you can't read. Built like a man die. Act like you can't bleed. Snoop album recognize. Bitch, I am Sam Sneak. Pissing on your title, get new meaning to the champion. Legend status don't mean a damn thing. If I can't feed my damn seed, I demand cream. Somebody gon' pay, or somebody gon' pay, or somebody gon' pay. Yes, sir. Yo, also, oh, oh, I got you, I got you, I got you too. So, Rock, me, anything you got coming up in these shows, any touring you doing, any states you about to be in, countries you about to see? Uh, I know you just came yo, back to, off. Yo, I'm about to shoot a movie. I'm about to do a movie. Oh, yeah? Yeah, I'm about to get my, my Slim Zell Washington. Ah! Uh, <laughs> nigga said <laughs> Slim Zell Washington. That was fire. Hey, that yo, was fire. Hey, yo, dude in the chat said to not tell Cassidy that Rock's the best rapper ever. <laughs> oh, my gosh. I think Cassidy making them whack ass beats. Dude. Yo, did you see this yeah, dumb that shit nigga? Is fucking crazy. Looking like you about to snap his whole neck off with that dumb shit Casio tone Fuck beat. Yeah. My first Casio beat we making that. Cassidy with the Casio. Whack bar the week with his beats. Huh? Man, we should have did whack bar the week with his beats. Whack beat of the week. That's <laughs> word. Right. Word. We should have. Oh, we should have did one with you here. We couldn't find one. I was looking. Speaking of speaking of um, can find. One, we just had the royalty event, so we can talk about that. Cause I, I was looking through the royalty event for Wag Bar of the Week, but I ain't really find one. I ain't even get through all the battles. Yo, you only watched a couple. But what of I will say is, yeah, I'll miss so we watch battles and then yo, we pick a Wag Bar. Yeah, yeah. And then we talk about it and try. Oh, we got a couple. couple I'll, I'll let you watch it. one after the show and say, yeah, a couple of niggas got them, bro. Uh -huh. right. Danny Myers got two. <laughs> yeah, nigga, yeah, yeah, yeah. Nah, we got a couple. I'm not gonna lie, like. I watch battle rap and I do be critiquing, saying like, all right, I could have said that better. But right. shit, like, you know, I, I I have those moments and shit like that. Like, right. You know, like. As we all do. Yeah, like, like no you doubt. know, like, but so only, only, only a person who really understand it, I feel, could could really do, could watch it from that and, right. and have those thoughts. Right. You know what I mean? Like, because I feel like, like, battle rap is almost like Fight Club, like, Something like like it's a private club type of thing. Like mm -hmm. you could be like if you sitting there watching battle rap with your shorty, or not. But if you know y'all niggas been living in the battle rap culture, but let's just say you sitting there and you gotta you you meet somebody new, right? Mm -hmm. Like you know you got like 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 I meet a new chick, right? And I'm sitting there with a she don't know like I'm sitting there watching she, she just come to the crib and this is what I'm watching right mm -hmm. she don't know she's not in that realm half of that shit go over right, her head right, 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 you know right, what I'm right. saying right. like I could take her to the battle right Right. we'll be there and niggas will be like, oh! and, and she'll be like what the fuck going yo, on I noticed that I noticed that a lot of the shit said in battles now are shit said that if you're not part of the culture, you, you will won't not get know. Right. yeah you know yo I mean? that's why I try to keep my shit universal like anybody that's, I try to keep my shit. That's mm -hmm. probably why they don't fuck with me. You know what? That's probably what it is. Because these niggas that just came up in battle rap, they only know the battle rap lingo. So when I start talking worldly shit, niggas yeah, be looking it's at like, me like an alien. Like a nigga have a battle, right? I seen the battle with um the Loaded Hollows and yeah, yeah, Guns yeah. and Cake. Yeah, yeah. Shit. The two on two, definitely. Right. Like, I saw that battle just on Christmas, right? Who you give it to? Huh? Who you give it to? Loaded Hollows. Yeah, me too. Um, yo, that's, I mean, I, I, 
that was one of the dopest performances that I've Lux. seen. In Yo, that that, that crazy, Lux you know, right man. there that shit was, crazy. was yeah. outside of that little whatever that was that happened in the second verse. Right. Like that little slip up, yeah, with whatever that yeah, was. Yeah, yeah. If you take that shit out, that shit is one of the best rounds of battle rap, yeah, son. Son, that like, shit was crazy. Them niggas bodied that. That shit was crazy. Right? Nah, they, they did, did get that, busy. Right? Performed it. Yeah, that right. shit was crazy. But in that battle, right, Tay Rock and um, Chess did the them the shell casings. That crazy. Shit, right? That was fire. Ridiculous, crazy. right? Crazy. Just today, right, I just saw that battle on. Christmas, right? Just today, when I got YouTube on, just letting the videos run on top twenty-five battle best lines ever right. of, of this year, right? Right, right? So I'm on the the video done sh switched three times. I don't know what I'm watching right now, but it's a bunch of it's a it's a compilation of mm -hmm. dope bar, battle rap bars, right? And I see what's his name, Mike P. Oh God, okay, right? Yeah. Why you say it like that? I ain't stop doing that, bro. Right. I don't like nobody, bro. I know. No, I don't, don't like nobody, no, bro. is the grumpiest this nigga. Like, I know, like, I know. God damn, he like, like, I know. He's I know. a tall guard. No, like, I'm telling you, that, look, let that man I'm live, you, man. I'm telling you, son, that was me and Ruck. I'm t this, is, this is why you niggas <laughs> couldn't get a deal, right? This is the same thing. <laughs> yeah, I'm see? I'm telling you, right? That. But this, this, he was the same nigga. But um, Mike P, right? That's him, right? The, right. Did you know what I'm talking about? Yeah, yeah, yeah. He got the he got a line, and oh, I ain't see the battle. All I saw was that line that's right. in the compilation, uh -huh. where, you know, it's a, like a few bars, but he take out what dimes and pennies and throw them on the floor. He's like, those is dimes and pennies, right? And the crowd go crazy because it's a play off of their shit. Right. This shit happened. I know that 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 double impact, you know, the the the, the summer and for impact those happened who, a while if back. If you never seen the shell case bar, you seen right. him do that shit, you'll be looking but, like. But see, um, real quick, that shell casing bar was done three times prior to Tay Rock doing it, though. It was it just wasn't on hmm. that. Was. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. On that type of stage. It was. You just told so, me something new. I yeah, didn't know that. I didn't know Absolutely, that. Absolutely, it's done twice before. I didn't know that. Oh, like the small, way small it, Yeah, it was crazy. Like, it was like he was directly, it was a direct, like his delivery was like Tay Rocks and, you know, and, and Chess was, you know what I'm saying? It was, the punchline was that it was their shit. You understand what I'm right, saying? Right, right, like, right. Like, you know, niggas will take, they got whole sections, are they, are they, are they rounds where they doing antics? Like a whole nother nigga shit though. Mm -hmm. You know right, what I'm saying? Right, right, right. Like I seen niggas try to, you know, I got a the, the whole bar shit I did against Sig Vicious back in the day. I seen battle rappers try to redo that, the whole prison candy bar shit I did mm -hmm. back in the day. I seen even, bad niggas try to even, redo that. Yo, the sickest bar of that battle right there, the woo, yo, the sickest shit that the shit that almost like I rewound that battle right now. If I go to that battle on my on my on my computer, it's probably. There, you know, right, right, right. right. Cued up, cued up. Because <laughs> I done watched it from there so many times. Right. That second round, right where he go, they mad, they minds ain't wizards like wizards like Oz. Only thing missing is the wand. Hmm? <laughs> this makes it more official. My guy got stripes. Nigga zip down. <laughs> right, bust right. out the ref shirt. That's right. the point, man. Right. Hollows right. whistling, whistling by. by. Yeah, yeah. Son. So the shit was crazy. I die every time I see that right there. Right, they do you understand what I'm yeah, saying? They perform the shit like, out of that. that. Well, who, who, who that? That, that was Lux, Lux and Hollow. Oh. Nigga said, who that? You don't oh, know who that is? You're so busy being mad at the shit. Yeah, right? right? You, Look at you, missed you, you got papers? You got papers. You're so busy being mad yeah, at the shit. Hollow's whistle. That, that shit was excellent, right? Yeah, that shit was but, um, very creative. Well done. Now, that whole... That whole but Three like rounds was no, but 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 but, but peep game like how peep. they use Hollow and Lux use b bars that they have for each other. They use their old battle. You understand what I'm saying? They use 
Like yep. even New Jersey twerk bouncing to like again. If you bring a, a strange chick to that battle, she didn't get none of that. Yep. Right. You understand what I'm saying? She didn't get none of that. But it's dope. I'm not saying it to knock it. I'm saying it's dope. I'm not like you know, like you part of this. Like you you part of this secret society. You know what right. I'm saying? And it's, and, and, and it's dope. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? But I get it. I appreciate it. Yeah, and if fine. I ever got roped into some shit like that, I would use all that shit too. Like, you know, I would use what I know. You know what I mean? Yeah. I wouldn't Cassidy myself. You know what I'm saying? Be nee 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 ass nigga. Yeah, B, Cassidy. Like, I know, if I, spit, I know if I spit a rhyme I got the way I got it in the battle, it ain't going to work. Mm -hmm. Right. And I'm not to say that that's exactly what he did, but what he did was in a lot of ways real similar to what he do on songs. Right. You know what I'm it's saying? It's not going to work like that. Yeah. It's not. That song of Pete, a lot of battle rappers be doing that shit. I don't like the shit. I, you know, I don't like nothing. I but like certain shit, though. You know, niggas be taking one line and one word, one word and breaking the nah, word I, down. Yo, how it. much bigger would the battle have been if Surf got to rap instead of chess because it was supposed to be surfing mm -hmm. Tate Rock. Yeah. Um, it would have been way bigger of a battle. Of course it would have been a bigger been. battle. Like, but would have been a better battle. Would it have? It probably could have The been. world will never know. Yeah. Because, um, you know, unfortunately, Surf was locked up at the time. I mean, mm -hmm. but he was out, but he just, they just continued to go on with, with yeah. chess and, um, you know, but Chess did a great job, B. Shout out to Chess. Yeah, he Back did. to the royalty thing. Yeah, he did. From is what that, I seen, that, right? Is that Petro Sour? I nigga Petro Sour right there? It might be. I don't know. Yo, I got to yeah, make an apology man. to Chess, man, because I've been, I been hard on Chess these last couple couple weeks, man, and Chess got he's been doing his thing, man. Nah, Chess is a Chess. He, uh... Chess is a dog off a leash. He what killed, uh, he killed yeah. Tory Doe this Yo, weekend. Yo, he did kill oh, Tory Doe, man. man. He killed Tori though, man. Shout out to Tori though. She from the town. Yeah. You know, I, I mean, I I wasn't really calling the winner in that battle because I was like, I had to see it. <laughs> Petro, what's good, nigga? But, um, <laughs> That's my guy right there. Shout out Petro Sour. I ain't see all the battles on royalty, but the battles I did see, one of them is Chess and Tori. Mm -hmm. Tory gave up. I mean, yeah, he it got it's yeah, Chess three oh. man. Chess, it's chess three. Chess four. Oh. Tori was upset with the. Her audio, yeah, yeah, she wanted to be yeah. Tori, she, 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 she looked like she gave up. She was, she was, she, she was annoyed. But, but, but like. like again, you know, no disrespect to Tori. I love Tori, but like she was at a place. Like Chess is way too seasoned for like. Mm. Don't get I mean, it fucked up. Tori's been around. Yeah, yeah, don't, 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 don't get it fucked up. Tori, Tori, Tori's nice. Tori Yo, put her foot in the ass, bitch. She put her foot in the ass, bitch. That shit was a little different, man. That that that's not a Queen of the Ring crowd. That was a URL crowd. Small venue, a lot of people. The Niggas knew what it shit. was, man. Niggas knew what it was. I'm pretty sure there were people there to see the girls too, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Niggas knew what it was, man. Tori do not wax, so of course niggas want to hear Tori what she got to say. Tori put her Tori foot in her ass, man. Let me I'm ask you saying. this: in a in a the, the male versus female battles, how 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 often does the female win? A couple of females won not yeah, too long ago. Yeah, a couple of females. No, I'm just saying. I'm not. I, not like, often, not often. I want to see them shits like, cause like, like when, 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 when NWX <coughs> battle, um, Bonnie and what you call it? Yeah, I think NWX won that, mm -hmm. right? But I think Bonnie and and Forty she did well. They did well. You said who? Bonnie and, and Bonnie, Bonnie and Forty. Yeah. I never seen that battle. They, they battle. So uh, yeah, RBE, like, I, like, RBE, I watched that battle multiple times. So RBE you know just had um Farrah and Clips. Yeah, that battle was funny as hell. And Farrah. um Shuni and O Red. Oh, o Red beat Shuni. O Red beat her. I got he Clips winning. He fucked Shuni the fuck up. I mean, he, you know the top he, tiers. He it's, it's it's rough, man. Yeah, because yeah, listen, but that's what I'm saying. I never listen, see it like there's a certain listen. I I, I hate self talking like this because I always sound sexist and I make women mad at me, but. It's, it is what it is, man. Listen, do you think the starting five of the New York Liberty could beat the New York Knicks bench warmers? It's not the same. 
You can't compare basketball same. to battle rap. No, no, we can play it. It's a different physicality. I'm just different. It is different, but what I'm trying to say is it's, it's, it's I different. Understand man, what you're trying female, to say. Like, I understand what you're trying to say, but it's just different. <laughs> nigga, nigga said, no, here we go. Right. Listen, like, listen, nah, listen, nah, listen. Nah, listen, maybe, maybe I'm, I'm saying it wrong, but it's always, there's a certain, I don't know, because women, there have been, women can beat niggas in, in battle rap. I feel like they can. Yeah, they can. There have been. See, but, I feel, like women, have, but hold I feel but, like women have the advantage. But this is my thing, right? Like, but it's, it doesn't happen that often. I don't. You know, I'm, I'm just trying That's to figure out saying. how it does. And it's it. like, cause this, I don't know. I don't know what it is. But it's like, it's like sometimes a guy don't have to do that much to win. Like you don't really have to go well, ball for ball with a female. You could do other like Charlie Clips and Farrah is a prime example. He ain't go ball for ball with Farrah. He kind of threw her off a game by just finessing her to death. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean, and I think when it when it when it looks that way, I don't see too many females beating somebody like that. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Like I don't want to say it like that. Niggas lose when they try to go ball to ball, ball for ball with females. Because if a female look, it's like a double standard. Because if she even remotely look, even if what he's saying is better, if she remotely look like she hung in there, niggas gonna be like she won. Right. Hmm. Understand yeah, that. That's like a double standard. Like me personally, I don't think that. I think females can, you know what I mean? There are females that can cut ass. I'm going to keep it you know I've mean? seen females cut just niggas' from ass. My, look, just from my understanding. But I'm thinking of, the, the way we view it. Look, I'm just from my understanding. From a like, world view From what you're saying, it's from, the, from a standpoint of content. Right. Like, it's certain, it's certain alleys women can go down lyrically that men can't go down. Right, you understand right, what I'm right, saying? right, right. So I feel like women should be able to, you understand what I'm saying? Like mm -hmm. they, they should have a decided advantage. So I'm just trying to figure out, what, you know what I mean? Like I want to. Because every female I think is super nice. I seen like, them lose to niggas that wasn't really like you or, remember, did, or who didn't even really go what, crazy on them. You remember like when Farrah when, when Farrah battled um what's his name? Forty smoked that nigga. I think it might have been Forty smoked Big T. Forty smoked him. Hell yeah, put Big him T. on my six hundred pound life. Smoke that 40 nigga. Forty beat Cortez too. Forty beat Cortez too. I don't remember that. I don't remember that. I don't remember that. Speaking nah. of Cortez. Cortez All right, Misfit, well, speaking of Cortez, Cortez and Misfit battle Geechee and Kofi Brown. Mm. Yeah, they had a two on two. And they won. Yeah, I, I added the Cortez and Misfit. Mm. They won. You know what I mean? Nah, but I think 40 dope. Now nah, 40, 40 battle Miss Hustle. Nah, but what I seen, what was the battle? It was 40 and what's, it might have been 40 and Shuni. No, 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 not 40. I'm Farrah and Shuni against. What's the dude named the, the the Christian nigga? Loso, oh, yeah. Loso. Loso and, and Street Hymns. Yeah, yeah. That that battle, like, I feel like uh, Farrah and them won that. Like they didn't win lyrically, but they was more entertaining. They finessed the shit out. Like man. they finessed the shit out. It could work either way. That's what I'm no, saying. No, see, that's what somebody just said in the chat. Um, he said, "Yo, the real question is, are the ladies as entertaining as?" Men in that battle, saying. they were it, entertaining. It got to be. Look, if you look be. at my it thing like be. this, the wackest male female battle to me is when they both try to go bar to bar with each other. It got to be some kind of form of finessing going on for, for like, I don't know. I don't know. Maybe it's me. But when I see dudes try to go bar for bar with females, if a female ever look, if she hang with you, she going to look like she won. Hmm. You know what I mean? Because of that double standard that's on it. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Yeah. Like, for, for the dude to absolutely look like he beat her, he has to finesse her. He has to do something to throw it away from the bars and be funny. And, right. You know what I mean? He has to do something yeah. else. You know what I mean? Same thing with the female. It, it, it can't be typical, yo, you got a little dick. Oh, your pussy stink. Shit, we, we, niggas gonna be like, yo, this is... But if she start doing crazy other shit, like, oh, niggas gonna be like, oh! Like, it's gotta be some kind of finessing going on. Like for instance, Rum Nitty and, and Official just battled. Niggas saying Official won. Mm. I watched the battle. She kind of did, mm. but they was trying to go bar to bar with each other. And official prides herself <laughs> on writing the bar, yeah. so you know she battling a nigga like Rum Nitty. She gonna write. Rum gotta do a little finessing. Yeah, this is the thing. When you understand you, what I'm trying to say? 
when it comes to like like official and rum, like they write like they write like us. Yeah. See, a, a, a official got like, that. Like, that like official, got, official can write. No, that girl they can write, write. No, like they write act. They write action flick. They write action flick balls. Yeah, facts. You understand what I'm saying? Facts. So when and 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 with the with with the the flow type, the gymnastics type of the roller coaster flow. You know what I'm saying? Like when you when you somebody who mastered that. You battling another. You battling somebody who else who mastered that. It could go either way any mm-hmm. day. Like Tay Rock and and Rum Nitty could battle twelve times, and it'll go either way every time. Mm-hmm. You understand what I'm saying? Right. Because they the same nigga to a certain extent. Right. You know what I mean? Right. And then that'll be a, a preface battle, hard body. That'll yeah, be but you know, it, remember, remember that nigga Pacquiao fought all them times. They kept going back and forth. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? That's that, that's that. You know yeah. what I'm saying? These niggas the same weight, same complexion, same height, same every fucking thing. Like they <laughs> same just, fight, like they same <laughs> fight every time. Same same amount of kids. I don't know what it was, but they just <laughs> went. You know what I mean? <laughs> back and forth. You know right. what I'm saying? And that's what it is. Like. Like a, a like like official is a f- is is a female version of that. Like you know what I'm saying. Like she write like like her bars are like that. Like mm-hmm. like I could take a verse of officials and spit it to a beat, and niggas be like that nigga rap just went in. They wouldn't know, n- <laughs> niggas wouldn't necessarily notice the difference. Mm-hmm. Yeah, cause she write like yeah she. You know write what I'm saying? Actually, yeah, you right, you right. She's one of those. Mm-hmm. You know, Miss Hustle is another one of those. Unfortunately, I feel like 40 bars got the best of Miss Hustle at this event. Yeah, yeah man, 40 was, went off. That was, that you know what I mean? got the best of Miss Hustle. Yeah, Miss Hustle, I ain't gonna lie. Miss Hustle, listen, shout out to Hustle, that's my little sis, she from the town. She mm-hmm. fucked that money up, man. But, um, <laughs> <laughs> yo, I, <laughs> yo, shout out to Hustle. Shout out to Hustle, I was rooting for you, man. Yeah, but, um, you 40, fucked that 40, money 40 up. You know how you, you fucked that money 40 up, 40 was bro. on one. Forty was on one. She was, and you know what it was? I think hustle. I think hustle was sounding like other people. Like she was sounding a little bit. She like ain't twerking. sound like hustle when she, she was with like Vixen. Hustle. She sound like she's trying to sound like twerk. She doing a deep voice on the punchline shit. Like yo, that's not you, hustle man. Go back to that. You know what I mean? Right. Yeah, like that. And, and I think I think. Forty stood out because she was being herself more than anything, and she Back she tax. stayed her. She this she is was, forty bars. She her, was poised. Her bars was hitting. She was she poised. She didn't choke, and she was poised, and she just did her. She ain't she don't sound like nobody but forty bars, and her shit was hitting. You know what I mean? I think that that's that would double stand out for me more than anything. So I think forty um, beat Miss Hustle. Yeah, you know what I mean maybe three zero, my nigga. I'm not even. I gotta watch it again. Mm-hmm. You know, Miss Hustle brought out E Heart too. You know what I mean? You know, because E Heart did the little funny shit and the they do. Which I guess thing. that was like a ploy to get it two on yeah, two bad. Yeah, know that was that. And then they took shots at the Bardashians. You Who know, the Bardashians? I call them kibbles Jazz and, and tits. official kibbles Jazz and tits. And, kibbles and, and, and tits. And uh, they just we added. Went, listen, we would not refer to them as the Bardashians here. That is kibbles <laughs> and tits. And yo, um, they yes. just added Casey J to their clique. To oh, the Bardashians. So the Casey J is a, is a, is a, is a but that with kibbles and tits. I like yeah. that too. Yeah, I seen her battle in that same that same um event. That's with, shorty from Texas, right? Yeah, yeah. yeah. That's she uh, she, 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 she that killed Miss Merck this weekend. She she thirty piece Miss Miss Merck gave up though, man. Yeah, Ms. I seen her battle with Miss Merck. Might get whack ball of the week just because she gave up. Man. Yeah, man. That was corn, like, like you know what I mean? If you wasn't ready, you wasn't ready. Writer? I got a question. But, um, you know, she just gave up. She gave up. She said, like, two, three bars in her second, and then she gave, she ain't, time she rap the third. She was just like, yo, fuck it. So, yeah, nah, you got to go ahead with that, man. It's for time. Slow order, man. We ain't doing that, Miss Murphy. Mark said he had a question. My fault, my guy. Do y'all watch the Cassidy battles? Over, like, I do. No. no, I do. No, I give I everything a fair chance. No, you know, no, 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 no. Time. They actually get worse. I'm gonna be real. With I you. would never. No, I'm gonna keep it real. The first time I was like, ah, then I went back, watched it, and then it kind of started registering because I was trying to hear when the they were saying. The first time I was like, ah. All right. Second time I watched it, I was like, all right. 
And the third time, it was just like, nah, you gotta get the fuck out of so here. So yo, when I when I, I watched the first time, when I yeah. watched him and Goods live, I was like, yo, what I the see fuck any of is this, right? Then when I went back and watched the Goods battle, I was like, oh, no, I, saw I, I missed a couple things. Mm -hmm. He was still not super good, but it was okay. And then him and Ars, I literally can't even watch it. I didn't watch that one again yet, but um, I was in the building for the, the Ars first one. the, the good the Goods battle. I watched it again, and the bars did. I, I was like, I did miss some shit. Okay, it was a little better. I mean, you know, it it, it was better. Right. I, 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 you know. You think he was better with the uh, versus us? It was a little better than he did versus Goods. I gotta watch that one again. No. I think his best Shit performance was, was against Disaster. Trash. That was the first one when he came Shit. back. Yeah, 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 he did his thing in that one. He did the best, his best performance when he did Disaster. That's when he first came back and, and did the shit. Yo, but again, too, that was in a small, it was in a parking what garage. What the fuck was talk about? So what? No, because it's it's trash. different trying to control 2,500 heads. I know, but you still, you I know? mean, that's the one that they had, and that's, yeah. the, one that, that's the one that count. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Right. If we have a fight, like, let's just say these was fights. It don't matter if, if I knock you out. It yeah. don't matter whether it's on a, in a parking lot or in Madison Square. You know what I'm saying? Right. Mm -hmm. A knockout is a knockout. And maybe you had to, maybe. You Yipsy! Know, maybe you had to, you were able to or had to resort to different tactics depending on where you were. You know, maybe the fact, you know, like when you play your video game, you fight with Blanca and his hood, you know, it's different, you know, it's different shit. You know, you fight. With Vega, this nigga get to jump on the fence and shit. You right. know, you got you got different shit. To, you know what I mean? Yeah. yeah. You just gotta win wherever you at. You know what I mean? Yo, me being a martial artist, baby, they used to always say you always just gotta trust in what you know. Yeah. You can't worry about what they got or what they gonna do or what they know. You gotta worry about have confidence in what you know. And that's you and know that's, what Cassidy needs. He needs crackhead <laughs> determination. Crackhead determination. We back to that. <coughs> crackhead determination. Yes, that, uh, thank you for bringing that back, Ike. Cause That's ain't what nothing he like some crackhead pen. determination. Crackhead yo, determination um, with his pen. So, yo, I got this uh, red man shit. Yes. Oh, yes. Let that rock and roll. Uh, let Come back that in the show. rock. Yeah. Uh, it's going to slap the shit out you, too. Yeah, yeah. So, so, funny as shit. Too. That's dope. Hi, I'm Red Man. White people call me Redman. This video is just for content and having fun. Giller House and Riverton Entertainment do not in any way promote violence towards women or men at any time. It is fucking wrong. If you're going through an abusive relationship or going through abuse period, I advise you to seek help, a hotline, or the police. Now I got that out the way. Excuse me. Oh, 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 oh shit. Look at the little baby, mm. yeah. oh. Are you serious? Can you pay my rent? Can you buy me a drink? Can I wear your gold? Can you take me? 
Take me to the mall and get me a pair of those. That's when I smack the shit out you. I smack the shit out you. That's when I smack the shit. Yeah. That's when I smack the shit out you. I smack the shit out you. That's when I smack the shit out you. Yo, smack yo if I gotta, I walk around the world trying to smack everybody. I'm certified. IG don't need to verify me. I smack the shit out you playing rich and being broke. I smack my kids taking batteries out the remote. I smack the shit out police when they pull me over. They stick my middle finger up to the camera on the shoulder. I smack the shit out you, then I smack the shit out you. And mind your business, bitch, ain't nobody talking about you. Can I borrow some money can i get some weed can i drive your car can you pay my rent can you buy me a drink can i wear your gold can you take me to the mall and get me a pair of those that's when i smack the shit out you i smack the shit out that's when i smack the shit out you i smack the shit out that's when i smack the shit out you i smack the shit out that's when i smack the shit out you i smack the shit out you Back baby, yo. <laughs> yo, what's yo. going on? We back, we back, we back, man. It's the good man, the asshole. <laughs> oh shit, yo, man, nice. yo, baby, nice. Yo, yo wet man is the funniest yeah. nigga on earth right yo, now, son. We about to close that is it out. Funny. We want to give a shout out to my man Rock, this monster in the fucking building. Yo, appreciate this, you this, for this, coming this, through, this, bro. brother. Appreciate you. Know what I mean? you Word, man. Thank you for coming through. Y'all already know. You this know, is my brothers. Yo, already. You know what I'm saying? This is it's a homie thing, society. bro. We always ask trust. Yes, yeah, all we man. ask is trust, B. Word, man. So all y'all go out there and subscribe, man. Subscribe, 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 subscribe. hit the bell. Subscribe. Hit the bell. Word. Hit the bell. Let everybody know, man. Spread the word, man. Your pet Pay me. It's out right now. Right. Word. Follow me on um on, on Instagram. Right. Mm-hmm. Rockness BCC on there. Mm-hmm. Yo, we glad y'all, y'all enjoyed us, man. We had to do it for y'all, man. You know hold, what I mean? Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. I got a website. It's called IamRockness.com. Uh-huh. Patreon.com slash Rockness Monster. YouTube, you can subscribe to me there. Mm-hmm. Monster Nation, you know what I mean. So, sorry, it's all, all all over the place, but rewind it, get it, subscribe. Facts. Yes, Write it, it down, down. Follow, take a picture. Follow, pause. Follow, pause. Your boy, um, it's a lot of shit coming. I'm working off like six albums, a movie, a boot camp album, and hopefully <clears throat> some other shit too. Some other yes, shit indeed. too. Yes, indeed. That's what I'm talking too. about. Word up. So I get all that you heard. Subscribe to everything you heard. Subscribe, follow, Team rock, Hobby follow, TV, spin, all follow Ike. Subscribe, Big subscribe, Show. Subscribe. Yes, I, yes, I do rap. Big Show, I and do. And tune in next week. Same bat channel. Same bat time.